Don't worry. Don't worry about buttons, even though I haven't unmuted you yet. Okay. Oh, thank God. Buttons, I have that motherfucker at like minus seven point five. I don't know what you want. Fam, it's I. I don't know what to tell you. It was so fucking loud. Jesus Christ. Hi everybody. Don't worry about it. It's Michigan time. I turned it to my big camera so that buttons wouldn't die anymore. But we're gonna. I super appreciate it. Cause now I'm gonna oh switch to. God. I'm gonna switch to this screen. Oh. Infinity loop, but don't worry. Let me find... Let me open your actual stream. Can we talk about how dark is the real goat right now? Dark is always the real goat, but well, what did Dark do with the maid and the real goat this time? Dark has spent literally my entire work shift, plus the entire time I was at the dealership modding my Skyrim for me so I could have a pretty Skyrim. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> I'll give my dogs a chance to shut the fuck up, and then I guess we'll... All right, so so because I'm I've I've reduced to. I know you're not done yet. <laughs> hey, Vap. What's going on, Vap? Um, I'm I only have one screen. So does everything look good on everybody's end? Uh, you know what? Wouldn't it be helpful if I looked at that? Yeah, it looks fine. Okay, like you can see on uh, what's it called? Parsec and. Yes, <laughs> it's like what the fuck is what's it called? <laughs> All right, and Vap says that they can see English, Francois, Italiano, and Espanol, so. France. Francois? I... It's Francaise, my dude. Francaise. There's no O. I'm fucking dumb. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so... I know you're from the valley, but damn. <laughs> Man, I, what do you expect? I'm American. All right. So this my is. Fucking favorite shit. Sorry to like totally interject. Suck my it's dick. the memes of Europe banning us Americans from traveling and people being like, well, then I'll just go to Greece. And it's like, hmm. <laughs> bloody. Good luck. Good luck with that. <laughs> All right. Uh, I can okay. still see chat, by the way, in case anybody's wondering, because I do have my phone out. I just wish I could have a second screen. What were you going to say? We're still on the language select, so it better be something good. I'm just screaming at Moon dude, that we're in Michigan. Oh. Although she's probably not home yet, so. So as you can tell from the title, this is a Michigan report from hell. Uh, this is a blind playthrough for me, certainly. I do know the gist, because I've seen, like, a review on it. But, like, I, other other than the fact that I'm going to be a cameraman and I can camerize, I can focus on uh, Monstars and Boobies, I frankly, Which is, I like, don't. literally all you need in life. Yeah. It's a 51 game, so while not... It's not going to be the same as Dead Prime, it's going to be the same energy. The same weird Japanese developer energy. Uh, I want to stop fucking around. Stoked, not going to lie. Push. Oh, God. Uh. Oh. Oh. I haven't seen an option for that ever? This is, this is 60 hertz shit today. Um, also, uh, let me know how the sound is when we get in there, because... Dude, vi video game sound is the most random shit. Look at this logo. <laughs> um, <laughs> video game sound is the most random shit. Like, even even Dead Prim with its whack uh Oh, God, hold on. Pause. Oh, that's pretty loud. Is it? All right, hold up. Let me hear it on the stream. Now you're going to see this. All right, I think it's fine. I think I'm just. It, it is going. It is going into the red. So I'm gonna... All right, fuck. Where's my? How do I? How do I make things go? Oh god. It's yeah. It's pretty loud. I turned out to minus ten. All right, hold on. I have parsec at six. <laughs> just so, just for comparison's sake. Jeez. This is, this is this is my point about video game audio. Where like, Dead Prem. Okay, yeah, with, with Dead Prem, I was fine at like minus five, even with it's all it's bullshit. Here it's like, all right. Yeah, it sounds better on stream now. But hello, Mike. Check my friends. Damn my goddamn ears. I'm good at hello until I get a. Button says it sounds good on, on their end. I cannot fucking believe that we have yet another game to reopen with technical difficulties. Goddamn, I can barely hear you though, even with this. Suffer. Alright, hold on. Here we go. We're gonna miss all we're gonna miss all this shit. 
Uh, no, I'm, I'm gonna restart it so that we can see this cut opening, but... Um... Alright. I'm gonna max you out at 200 fucking percent. Oh, Seems that's a like... dangerous move, my friend. <laughs> nah, listen. Drastic times call for drastic measures. Uh... Is the game still hella loud? How do I work technology? I don't know. Okay. Hold on, I'm gonna mute Parsec completely and just listen to it through stream. Alright. Hopefully it'll replay its, uh... Lazy! Hello, it's thank- friend that sounds suspiciously like Avery, but is not. Thank you. Thank you, uh, for the follow. Um, the game is apparently rather loud. I have it minus 15 decibels. It sounds fine to me because like I can I can now hear you over the game. Right. And I can hear myself over the game, so Well well. Okay, Hello, yeah, actually it's still a little bit loud. Alright, we're gonna Sorry. No, it's fine. It crescendos randomly. Yeah, L Lavery makes a good point. Watch it be the starting screen that's loud. Alright. Minus 20. I'm, I'm farther down than I've ever been before. That's what she said. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, in fact, I gotta, I gotta mess with my own fucking mixer here. Alright. All volume up. Hey, to me. Turn this fucker down. We are shocking no one having technical difficulties. No. Now I have to turn you down. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It's not any technical difficulties, it's just... Jesus Christ! Why are these games so fucking loud? Alright. Buttons, I need you to talk. <laughs> I'm laughing too hard, really. Okay. I think... I think you sound... You sound fine there for me, and I sound fine to you, last we checked. Jesus Christ, guys, I have this... I'm going down Michigan all the way, holy fuck. Guys... I have I have two Juds happening right now, and it's actually kind of fucking me up, real bad. Well, if you got two Juds, of course it would. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Doctor Manhattan up in here. All right, all right. So there's one of me at each one. Well, there's one of me at each end, but then you look out in like the the other room, and I'm doing a science experiment. So. <laughs> So I guess the important question is, are we going to be titty men or ass men? I'm doing both. All right. Get the fuck out of here. First of all, before we even worry about titty and ass, like, how about our fucking ears? Here's the third time this thing's played. <laughs> With the crescendos and the... Y'all let me know how this is sounding, because... Now it sounds too low. Button's mic is kind of low to me. I... Okay, you know what? With the fucking bullshit crescendo, the game sound is fine. But yeah, my mic is still low. Well, you guys are... It's on the same track. I don't know how to fix that. It's all desktop audio. Just, just raise it. Just raise it. Alright, I'm going to raise this roof. You know, come to think of it too, and I feel really dumb now that I thought about this. I'm assuming the actual game is not going to have bellowing crescendos. So maybe the way to fix this is to just go like that and press start. I have a compressor. I have I have all the shit. Video games are just fucking loud. We're going to skip that opening cutscene because it's blowing out everybody's ears. If you want to watch what it, if you want to watch it, you can go on YouTube. Yeah. I usually like to watch that shit, but fuck, man. All right. Buttons, keep a uh, keep a uh, keep an eye on people on the chat for me, just for in case of people, if there's yeah. still uh you know audio shit. I All right. All right. Well, I rest in peace, guys. If it sounds bad, still. Uh. Out of curiosity, dark or not dark? Judd, wrong friend. Um, did you? 
when you did the the volume mixer did you just lower the emulator or did you lower the entire kit and caboodle oh shit i lowered the well i lowered the emulator so i could hear you but i guess that would affect but that would affect the uh wouldn't it oh shit yeah you need to just lower the emulator not the whole kit and caboodle so i'm still the same sound the same yeah I, I did that okay that's not but but that's not gonna affect desktop audio is it like for the actual capture it was so fucking loud in parsec it does not matter all right <laughs> So the original point I was going to make is like video game audio is fucking wild. Holy shit. Basic controls, left hand slide, move camera, man. Right, move camera. L2, ram. Hold down for a powerful shove. X to focus. Oh, God. Hey, yo. So you're the new cameraman, huh? I hear you're a rookie. The name's Briscoe. I'm the sound guy. <laughs> I love this already. Nice to meet you. Now it's really hella quiet. What the fuck? You've seen her before, haven't you? Okay, here we go. She's Zaka. Is it really? Star reporter, after all. Hey, you're pretty lucky to be teamed up with Pamela right off the bat. Oh, I love the name Pamela. But don't go getting any funny ideas about her. You hear me? Of course, Pamela probably wouldn't give you the time of day anyway. Man, what could the agency be thinking? I mean. Sending a newbie like this. So paranoid about the balancing. <laughs> huh? Oops. You hear that? I know. Does everybody hear it? Don't let it bother you. Um, it's bothering me. I'll be teaching you everything you need to know about TV news coverage. Listen up and do exactly as I oh. say. Oh. Hey, movement. Move near Briscoe. Goodbye, Briscoe. <laughs> 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 huh, huh. Of course. A cameraman's number one job is to be able to shoot things properly. It doesn't get any more basic than that. You know what to do, what? right? Okay. First off, I pull out a gun. Try shooting that box there. I must focus on the box. What, <laughs> so I... what box? Oh, you know, the the box. What fucking box? <laughs> It's just an ordinary box. Go back to Prisco. <laughs> Fine. You should be able to do at least that much if you call yourself a cameraman. Number two, you gotta have an eye for scoops. Oh, like butts and boobies. Let them pass you by. Right. Just pointing scoop up a butt. Things will never get you a scoop, you know. If you want a scoop, you gotta get out there and make one. And you can't just stand there like a stick. You gotta move around. Up high. These low. subtitles fucking suck. You gotta suck. shoot the subject from every angle. There are spots called focus points. Hit OK. Move around now and try to find some of these focus I didn't see an option for them, though. To turn them off, so. They gotta be like the fault shit, right, then? Oh, I guess oh. that's like... The green? Oh, here we go. I'm gonna I'm gonna get some scoops. <laughs> oh my god. Here we go. What? Oh, what the fuck? If you focus on the... You can move along with her, keeping the camera steady on her. Okay. The focus point hit it in the city. Explain, what? They also provide hints and tips to help you along. It's so it's fucking fast. <laughs> Just get, get good at reading. Go back to Briscoe to continue the tutorial. Brenda, why can't I zoom in? Ha, get fucked on. Here we go. This is this. I'll just get right back. Good enough. Reeve on her. <laughs> that outfit is atrocious. Nah. I, oh fuck. What? <laughs> get fucked on. There's a shit about boobs and butts. We have a binder over here. It's the binder. <laughs> marker show the reporter will move to next. Oh, oh the marker indicates what happens when she's. Oh, the, I'm gonna fuck the. I'm gonna fuck this game up so hard. You guys, are you ready? I'm already confused as fuck. Like, no, you're supposed to focus on the reporter, my guy. Reporters yeah. act of their own free will. Your job as a cameraman is to follow the movements of the reporter. I'm trying. I'm listen. I'm talking to these books and getting dialogue options. You know. <laughs> All right. You can't even. All right. Focus on the reporter. Oh. 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 I see. I, I wasn't close. Far. I wasn't close enough. Bitch. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm focusing on you. Oh. 
Okay, I'm, I'm refocused. She's got mad um Maria from Silent Hill 2 vibes. Going, going back to Briscoe. Briscoe actually I'm talked to me. Sad Lavery was AFK for me to make that reference. Did you find anything? Okay. Next top. Oh, I guess I didn't go out more enough. Whatever. Ramming is a technique you can use in a pinch. Oh, I'm ready to ram. A cameraman can only use his body, you see. He can't take his hands off the camera. I look at Briscoe's crotch. Okay, try ramming into me right now. <laughs> Not too hard, though. You hear? <laughs> you, you ready? What wonderful timing! Okay, go ahead and try. A cameraman has to whoop people's asses at any moment. Just practicing here, remember? Okay, go. Easy now. Okay, I got it. I won't. I won't beat your ass. I'm ramming into Briscoe. Not too hard, though. Oh. Hey, you idiot! I told you to take it easy. Got a problem? Son of a. Now only use ramming in emergencies, okay? You'll know when. Just use your common sense. I can't do. It. I was gonna. Oh, that's a tough. That's a tough call. <laughs> Go back to Briscoe. Okay. Here I am. What? I like how the tape actually winds down. So you're the new guy, huh? Oh. I'm Pamela. Pamela Martell. Are you now? Okay, Briscoe. I'm borrowing the new guy. I hate that outfit so fucking much. Okay. Fine. I hate it. It's th so bad. I think it's fine. Time, you know. No, it's garbage. <laughs> it can be tough out here on location. We've okay. got to work as a team, okay? Okay, genuinely, this prompt comes up when I'm near her don't fucking worry, womb. He's always like that. <laughs> I don't know, that kind of makes me a little weirded out. Guy, I think you're supposed to be... be oh, run into that green thing on the floor. Oh, what? One more thing. The green thing on the floor. Run into it? Game yeah. Scoops is important, but it's not the only thing in my These are the focus opinion. things, remember? And you kind of, like, keep it green while it's on her as she comes... If somebody right in front of you needs help, or if there's some kind of emergency... I think you should stop shooting and help them. Or well, not. I... Oh. oh, what? I pressed triangle. I was just about to trip over that board. Oh. Thank you. So that's the way you work, is it? Where she's going? Yeah. Okay. I so I thought. Well, we're going to get along just fine. But it's a really big microphone box. Board, it's so you big. You might have gotten a little scoop on me. Oh really? Well, really, Pamela? I guess we'd better head back to the news van. I can't move. Okay. <laughs> Zaka, the AKA V Team Log, A twenty. An unusually dense fog covers the southwestern area of Lake Michigan, centering on Chicago. The federal government has advised evacuation of cities in the area, including Chicago. Oh, wow. Why? There's no official word yet on the fog's cause. Isn't this just Cloverfield? Isn't it just the mist? Or the fog? Oh, yeah. I forgot about that Stephen King novella. There's no fog in Cloverfield. There's just a big fucking monster beating the shit out of the city. But doesn't it, like, come out? Oh, no. It comes out of the ocean, not out of the fog. I'm a dumbass. Began shooting with the above team. Oh, I really like the implication that you can swap team members out. Probably by death. Okay, wake up. Time for a scoop. Get up. Are you ready? Got your tapes. Oh, this voice okay? me. Oof. All right. Pamela is standing by outside. Make her look good now. And leave the sound to me. Oh. This is a oh, that was so bright. I'm not doing this. This is a cutscene. Okay. Good evening, everyone. This is all oh, those Martell. lip animations. Oh, oh no! Oh. An unusually I dare say that's actually worse than Dead Prim. Oh, it is. Oh, it super is. Ooh, it's Uncanny Valley. It's so much worse. Someone screamed. Let's go. That's just Sadie wanting her food. Like that's the exact sound Sadie makes when she's like, "Feed me, you dumb bitch." They just taught me how to play the game, and like this perfect moment to like. Oh. Heather Mason. To you? Got really quiet. Oh, never mind. She's a redhead. Or brunette. What are you talking about? What happened? Oh, so their sound guy was away. Okay. 
Uh. Oh. Uh. Oh. 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 Uh. I was joking about Cloverfield, but I'm really happy. I Man, you yeah. <laughs> I fucking love Cloverfield. That movie is such what garbage. No, the first one slaps. And only the first one. Slaps, but it's still got like the garbage found footage shit going on. That is the only time found footage was used well. Because it... I mean, th think what it did for a giant monster movie. Oh god, Pamela, please. Pamela, we should be running? Oh, those shoulders. Oh, god. Oh, hey. You're about to get fucked. Let's do I hit triangle? Yeah, triangle. I'm, pr I'm matching triangle. Alright, so maybe this is cutscene, so you might not get the choice. Well, good. <laughs> Jesus Christ! I was gonna say, Blair Witch was... Like the OG Blair Witch was pretty good. Jesus Especially, fucking like, Christ! I watched, that, I watched that probably way younger than I should have been allowed to watch Blair Witch, but my mom <laughs> was obsessed with it. And my mom, I distinctly remember my mom and my aunt going camping at my grandparents' campsite and making a bunch of those twig fucking doll things and hanging them from the trees. And like, I'm still finding those fuckers. And that was like what? Uh, like 18 yeah. years ago? Something like that, yeah. Received information on a possible survivor in the Chicago International Hotel downtown. 10.23 a.m. Arrived at International Hotel. No branding, nice. Filling in for Pamela Martell. Who? News reporter Ann, Ann Anderson. Anderson. That's a white name. <laughs> <laughs> then you got Jean-Philippe Jean Briscoe. Briscoe. Searched hotel but didn't find any survivors. All we found was evidence that some gruesome incident had occurred. Oh, we found some evidence. It was those fucking yeah, demon did. beasts. All oh, the gruesome apples. Oh, they're just horrible. Can I, can I play this game yet? You... No. Oh, I, I'm actually in control. Okay, cool. I mean, that whole sequence could have been playable. Get fucked on. You know what I'm no, saying? No, this is an old-ass game. The, the game literally could not support that. It, it, I mean, it wouldn't have looked as good. It would have looked like in-game graphics, but we could have had that. Nah. But then what's the rest of the game if we're not doing that? If we're not having monsters like come out. We have to save room to have more monster running. Oh, hey, you're much nicer looking. In that room? And I just oh, mean... cute. Yeah. What a bloody mess, huh? All right. I'm not sure what Let's accent she's supposed here. to be pulling off. There isn't anybody left in the whole hotel. Looks yeah, like I don't know what's... just a false lead. Briscoe uh, went downstairs alongside Christ. Me. And anyway, the other teams are getting the jump on us. We what don't other have teams? Time to waste hanging around here. We've got to get out there and find something. Huh? Why is it focused on their crotch and womb for this? <laughs> I'm sure that's gonna work real well. How's, guys, I know I've been asked this a lot. How's the volume sound right now? To y'all. Is it just right? Do I need to turn it up? I'm not your mother. I mean, you're also about the voice acting, so I'm guessing it's good, but. I can't hear you very well. Wait! Don't hang up! Where I think the game might have worse sound mixing than Dead Friend. I think it's just the music. The observation deck of the center building? Is there anybody else there with you? <laughs> the game is a little quieter than you. Okay, I've got it. Just stay Well, I guess since you turn away. down the stuff in the the master volume mixer, you There's can up the decibels in uh OBS. Alright. Don't give up. We're coming, I promise. Let me uh let me get to a point where I can just pause this. The voice I think is so weird because it's a mix between like decent old horror game and like Nancy Oh she teleported. 
Venture Builders. <laughs> Let's go. Maybe we can get some leads on what's going on. Right on. I am dead yeah. ass certain that whoever's voicing Anna Somebody Anderson voiced trouble. Nancy Drew in a goddamn Nancy Drew Risto video game. Should be downstairs. Let's hurry. All right, Anna Anderson. <laughs> wow, that's a pause uh, if I ever heard. All right, let me uh, let me up the decibels a little bit on our adventure here. Moon, truthfully, you have missed like fucking nothing because we have been fucking around with the audio the whole time. I'm gonna turn it up to twelve. Okay. Yeah, so it's gonna be neg twelve, and we're gonna see how that works out for everybody. I guess yeah, it was just I, part of the problem is I think we're just judging it by that opening cinematic with the stupidly loud music. It was so fucking loud and just crescendoed the whole way through. All right, I'm trying to. There we go. Focus on Amy Anderson. I know it's like a side effect of PS1 to PS2 games, but the, the shoulder to armpit area freaks me the fuck out on these models so bad. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah, we've discovered that too, Moon. Moon says the game is horrendous at telling you how to do things, by the way. Am I doing it? I'm fo. <laughs> Let the reporter take care of the doors. Okay, well. Would you like to? Oh, please let me go. Nope. Reporter, come back. Ann Anderson. We had a football tackle. Unzoom, my dude. It's dude. It, it, there's no. That's that's what Moon says. I'm. I'm. It, there's no simple unzoom mechanic. It's either you lock onto shit and then it tells you about Very shit. Thick pools of blood on the floor. Thank. Never would have guessed. Yo, bitch, come over here. Nah, we don't get to make decisions. We just get to follow. What's the point of me being able to fucking? Because you get to make decisions to save people, but that's it, and you have to do them while following the report. It's a fucking. We're playing a found footage game, my guy. <laughs> well, look. Like, think I've, of it like that. And I found this door handle right in front of you. Could you open the door, please? Oh, okay. I guess I just had to press X again. God, this control scheme is fucking weird. What? Oh, what of course that? we're going through. X button go through, but then bracket triangle? It's a choose your own adventure. Apparently. Who knew choose your own adventure found footage game i am gonna fuck this game up so bad <laughs> i hope you're all ready fuck this shit right up also it's not the same design but yeah come here the floor really really reminds me of the overlook hotel yeah kind of god i fucking love the shining so i'm gonna ask for the millionth time now that i've turned it up a little how's our how's our sound I mean, how, how's the sound when she talk? I guess. I guess you have to tell me when she talks. Yeah, we went from crescendoing music to fuck all. Nothing. Yeah. Oh, good. The elevators are still working. I have. God, I was hoping for a dead body. Come on, oh. going down. <laughs> I really wanted a dead body. And oh god. Scoop indicator. The scoop indicator at the top of the screen shows what kind of scoops you have been focusing your attention on. The E on the left indicates erotic points. <laughs> on the right indicates suspense points. I've had an E the whole time, even though I've only... No, I've looked at their butts a lot. You have looked at their butts literally the entire time, my fucking guy. I mean, they haven't given me much else. I, I looked at some blood. You literally are not helping your case that you're an ass man. Who's playing the piano? Well, she's not showing a lot. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> She wasn't showing much cleave. <laughs> <laughs> and please, we've only just met. Brisco, what are you doing? You're supposed to be working. Hey, this Brisk. Man's what the fuck, Brisk? Oh, oh, oh. He's drunk. Damn. That's even better. I can't play this song like that. Oh god, I'm stuck in PS1, PS2 barriers. If I just, can I, what if I just push him? Ram him! I can't. Damn. I still can't believe it. Did it really happen? Oh 
kind of a way to die with that? What am I gonna tell her parents? Oh, this, this is actually kind of this, fucked up. This drunk voice acting is so good. Okay. I know. I'll tell him. Oh, there's a meter. I'm leaning more towards suspense. By the way, Judd is soundly in the suspense point side, just so you know. Yeah. Oh, we'll fix that. Don't worry. Yeah. Pamela was pretty brave, wasn't she? If I ever die to a monster, I want you to tell my mother she threw herself into her work. I was crazy about Pamela. Like, promise me. <laughs> there we go. Get that meter back to E. <laughs> <laughs> I understand how you feel. Why would you turn Remember, away to confess that? Pamela and I started together. And uh friendly rivals. Look, I wish it didn't happen either. But you know Also Marco to answer your question, Judd is the epitome of an ass all, man. God, it's true though. <laughs> and I won't let Pamela I would be focusing more here if she was someone more cleave. That's sexist. That's why we've got to keep going. For Look, I'm trying to get to the E meter, man. What do you want from me? And you're getting even further into the S. I know. What the <laughs> fuck is what the fuck is this game? Because them titties are covered up, so there's a lot of suspense. <laughs> I hate I hate every outfit I've seen yeah. in this goddamn game so far. Yes, you're right. I hate it so Look, much. Briscoe's got like a frog man or something on his shirt. He he, he has people shirt. You both sure? I got, I got sober up. Yeah, you do, bud. Yeah, you do, buddy. Think you could lend me some water? All right, sure. Nah, don't tell me how this works. Let me, uh, let me just fuck this shit up. Guys, my oh. fucking nail glue is glued shut. This is a fucking catastrophe and a crisis just my imagination once again just my imagination <laughs> <laughs> i'm glad we we're on the same track there oh yeah <laughs> there's been two there's been two same-minded tracks this fucking game song references and ass <laughs> yeah no shit there ain't anybody here hello this isn't america during covid so, and you want to uh, up my erotic points here, or what? what's going on? Oh, okay, Cheers. see you later. <laughs> Drink, is what that just says. Drink. <laughs> Remember when animals killed me by running me over? <laughs> oh, what? <laughs> Mick fucking... Oh, fucking thank. Oh, Jesus Christ. Rammer, rammer, rammer. I'm... I did it? <laughs> did I do it? Oh, thank god. I'm like, if it punishes me for doing this, I'm gonna Look at that thing fucking not even moving its legs. It's just fucking going. God, I hate spiders. It disappeared, of course. Shitty PS1 spiders. You alright? Yeah, right, girl? You doing alright? <laughs> Yeah, she did pee at that. That was genuinely kind of scary. I was like, uh. Got fucking nervous. What are we doing here, Annie? Picking up this bottle? Or maybe do I gotta show you the bottle? I have to show you the bottle, don't I? Look, Ann. Oh, it's water. I heard laughter. I don't like that. Oh, man. I hope it's Chucky doll. The great. Let's get back to Literally, no fucking joke. She would have died. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> I'd come back to fucking Briscoe, who's already fucked up, and be like, oh yeah, uh, Anne's dead, By sorry. the way, we killed the replacement. <laughs> we found some, Briscoe. That was so weird, because uh, cause the first lady's like, you need you need to press triangle to save people, and this one's like, fuck you, you're gonna ram her. Ooh, I'm a new man. Wow. Okay. Back to covering the news. Oh, I should press the knife between anyone sober up. That was a quick recovery. Okay. There's a survivor in the center building. Okay, got it. The van's outside. Let's go. 
Everything's so fucking suspenseful. You can't. You, I'm, I'm Jen. I... Band, band. Moon, band your husband. <laughs> oh damn! Someone's gonna ram her post though. Oh no! I don't like this. I was joking about Cloverfield. Jesus Christ! Running into monsters. Report always has their gun handy. <laughs> is going on that's why we're reporting in america so you can have your gun all right i got where are they so i can focus on them oh it's getting real fucking dark Fire. oh these trilobites before they why kill us they have fucking cannons hello ah, i Damn it, I marked that motherfucker. Film that thing. Yeah, film it. You just can't shoot it. Can't shoot it without filming it. We're not getting sidelined over here, are we? No, alright. Ugh. Shoot it, Ann. Ann, take care of us. We will do nothing. I'll never have erotic points now. <laughs> Unless we sell this footage to like a niche community. There's probably a very niche community that would be so down for this. Good job, man. Look at your fucking gun. <laughs> I guess the big one got scared and took off. I'm sure he was scared. That wasn't so tough, really. But let's get out of here before the big guy comes back. Come on. Frisco yeah. is super yes, insufferable. You're absolutely right. Going to fuck. Oh. <laughs> I guess oh, not. Never mind. The fuck goblin. Mm. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I'm not going to say that. That's creepy. Not offensive. Just creepy. I still don't want to say it. Oh. On the way to the center building in the news van. It's a news van. What the fuck? It's one of ours. Let's join up with them. Never mind, you're gonna read it, I guess. You guys at home, because... We didn't see anybody around the van, though. More details later. No, Bris Briscoe's just gonna run his mouth during this. There isn't anybody inside. Get your Glock ready. Fuck. Oh my god, the trigger so. discipline, bitch! Uh, no! Oh no, she, wow, she held it right at her fucking... Where did they go? I can't walk. I guess I should focus on her. I could get the, uh, oh, uh, oh, mmm, this seems familiar. There's somebody over there. Huh? Pamela? Oh, Pamela. Oh, no, buddy. Oh, oh, buddy, no. Hey, what's the matter with you? Hurry up and give me a hand. Wait, but I'm the cameraman. Why am I just helping him? Yes, I am. Oh, this is gonna be bad. What's with like the weird hentai moaning? She's got a, an alien inside her. Let's go. Oh god. I might. Did it, is it me or did it actually get quieter? Oh dear. Oh hey, you were right. Of course, I, come on. <laughs> Oh, that, that, though. Buddy. Have you not seen these movies? Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Oh, no. Oh, Jesus. It'd be one thing if she was walking on her hands, too, but, but that shit. Jesus, this this game is both actually scary and fucking stupid at the same time. Immoral is a fucking thing? Okay. I guess that's if you don't save people? That was a cutscene. I, I didn't have a choice. Right. She, she, was cutting, she was coming at us coochie first whether we liked it or not. <laughs> like it's just, oh my god. Oof. 
You oof, but I'm not wrong. Come on. Hurry, this way. Fucking cooch goblin was coming right at us. What the fuck is going on? All right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. No, shut up. No, buddy. No. Buddy, she was not. Buddy. Buddy, buddy. Briscoe, take it the fuck easy. Yeah. Anyway, let's hide out here for the time being. You guys need me to turn up a little more? I feel like it's gotten a little quieter dialogue wise on my end. So this mysterious Jogo is Be ready to shoot. Says the moon. Like Okay. They're broken. We can't get out this way. Uh, I thought I saw that. Oh, let's go get the fuck out of the way. All right. Moose says he could boost it if you want. All right. Here we go back to the nether realm. <laughs> once once we get it locked in though, like I'll be able to I'll know that number for next time. So I cannot believe that the goddamn intro was so loud. Yeah. I think that I think that skewed our results kind of uh, badly. It's ten decibels louder than the rest of the goddamn game. Yeah. All right, I've moved it up to negative eight. I would I would think it's good there, but all right. Uh, also, when there's monsters, there's like a draw distance fog. You have to oh, okay. That I I actually am fine with that. I like the arena aspect because fuck, there's a lot going on. Why can't I move? I can I can move, but oh oh, I had to press X to go through. There's even fog in here. Oh, it's like literally every time you go through a door, you have to press X, even though you're open. Oh, in her office memo. Attention! Attention! Please ensure the key is replaced in its original position. All right, so I guess there's a key someplace we're gonna have to go find. Right on. It's really foggy fog. Yeah, I'm, I got my eye right in. Got my eye right on her. Okay, I guess. Really, a fucking computer in a horror game doesn't give me anything. Nope. Uh, there's a key though. Where? Oh, on the. Uh, I see it. Yeah. This is weirdly like that Super Nintendo Pac-Man game. <laughs> Where you have to make Pac-Man do shit. What's this key for? Uh oh. Huh. Is that what you call a scoop? Shut the fuck up, dude. God, I would scoop on that fuck. Oh, where'd she go? Oh, okay. I'm like, oh, don't leave like that. Here, I'll tell you to open the door. Yeah, I, I'm gonna. I think. she go? Oh, okay. She's not gonna. <laughs> Fuck that door. Oh, I'm stuck on something. Um... That memo say can't activate it again okay well guess we're just gonna go back out the door here wait no there's a monster out there but we can't just stay here it'll corner us All right. Huh? Why can't I move? Why can't I move? Oh. Okay, now I can move. Oh my god. Oh yeah. That's wow. These fucking hand cannons again. You gotta keep focusing on it so people can shoot. I know. I'm trying. It's not. It's not as. You, like, you think it's easy to just keep it on there? For some reason, it's not. Hey, can we back up? Can we back up? Can we back up? 
Oh, she's dead. Oh. 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 No, she's dead. Oh. Well. I'm very confused by the vagina gecko. Well, you probably should not be that close to that thing. I was trying to... Trying to beat its ass. I don't think that's a plan. Oh, I think I just died. I think going forward killed me. Even though I went around it. Hmm. Thinking emoji. <laughs> Briscoe is fucking useless. Briscoe, you fucking dickhead. This is your fault. I'm blaming you. I'm blaming this on you. Now, I don't know. I don't know if it's like a fail four type game where like that's just it. We're fucked or... It seems different. Oh, God, God damn it, Ann. Jeez, I clicked on that fucking thing so many times. I probably should have tried to get in, like, not in front of it, but, like, more forward focused on it. So, to explain what I was going through there, there's a weird kind of, for lack of a better term, hitbox. It sure is quiet. Maybe everybody evacuated already? Oh, people. Mr. Briscoe? Uh, oh. Thank goodness. I'm so glad you're okay. Hey, it's Carly. Carly, it's Carly. Are you suddenly so everyone? loud? A few teams are still out covering the news. They told me to get out of the city, though. But I forgot something back here at the office. I came to pick it up just now. <laughs> I see. I will get this to eat. God damn it. Um. Do you think you could wait for me for a minute? Boy, you are huh? fucking struggle bussing. Oh yeah, sure. How do you how do you play as a pervert in this game? I'm I'm looking at butts so much and just like Well, according like, to Moon earlier, you have to crouch and follow their butt. Crouch? So you have to like full cliche hentai it, I guess. They gave me no crouch button. There's no button for crouching. You can die to the spider. There's a I can push. And like that's I can I can push. That's what I can do. I can't crouch. Unless I'm not allowed to crouch yet for some reason. I'm not mastered crouching in game. Oh. Hello. The okay. Saka TV staff yearbook. Oh. Oh. Look at this picture of you. You look weird. Fuck off, and dude. This girl. <laughs> Take a look. Hey, there's. Oh God, fish. damn it! Oh She's God, not again. So beautiful, Pamela. Look. Any of the events She's you smiling. go through with the reporter, they no. can die from. Wow. She always looked her best when she was smiling. I can't beat this man's ass right now. That's making me upset. I'm leaving. See ya, dude. <laughs> God damn it! Yep, see ya. I'm just gonna leave you. God damn it. He's so fast. He's like Sonic the Hedgehog. Open this door, dude. Seems to be locked. Jesus Christ. Briscoe, I fucking hate your guts. Oh! Briscoe, I'm gonna get you killed the moment I can. <laughs> God damn, dude. So, okay, we came in through the elevators, right? Uh, yeah. Oh, what? Thanks for waiting okay. For me. We did? I was just trying to find her, so we're oh, in. We did. Wow, that's awful. Both Pamela and Anne were really dedicated to their work.
All right, Carly, you're my new door opener. Oh God, what's happening? There's nobody here. Carly, you better have a gun. Where did everybody go? They appear to be. Oh, I'll just read it. Oh, never mind. Something about a side of a crash. The army was like pretty jumpy too. Fuck, I'm stuck. Oh, 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 Briscoe, you son of a bitch, please. <laughs> I don't know. It's not very clear. Does Agni. Oh! Um. Girl? Maybe somebody's in the back room? I fully expected to die right no there. No sign of anybody here either. All Zaka TV reporters carry the standard issue official Zaka TV hand cannon. <laughs> Wasn't very canon enough because Anne got smoked. Girl. Oh. Hey, that's the telephone. It is. Zaka TV, may I help you? Hello? What? What are the Peanuts parents doing here? Uh huh. Okay, don't worry. Just calm down and speak slowly, okay? Me? I'm Carly Reese. Yes, that's right. From the evening. Oh, I got a quick turn button. Smoke or be smoked. <laughs> you do? Well, thank you. Yes. Oh. It didn't yeah. tell me, but there is a manual it's zoom in. An evacuation advisory. I see. You can't get out of bed. <laughs> Where are <laughs> you? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, what a great fucking game! Okay, come on, man, <laughs> give me the give me those e points. All right, start focusing on the what actual important shit and see if the e points go up. It was an elderly gentleman in a nursing home. It sounds like he's been left behind there. We're gonna go rescue him. Well, Japanese yes. people love Bobby, so maybe this will count. Oh, why is it so wavy? Holy shit! Danger for one day. Thank you very much. When you zoom in, it's like a sniper rifle in a modern shooter. Where they account for like unsteadiness. The rescue services take care of it. It's not our job. But those services aren't running anymore. <laughs> what the dot there? No. <laughs> no. What else do you suggest? Jesus Christ. Still suspense. An elderly gentleman out there. Fucking hell. I'm trying to figure out how to crouch. It's like an apparently crouch. You just want a good story, that's all. How rude! Of course not! What are you doing, Briscoe? <laughs> Holy shit. God damn it. I guess we gotta go. Briscoe was freaking the fuck. Oh my god, Briscoe, please. Rest in fucking peace. You decided peace. to go? Thank you, Mr. Briscoe. He's tweaking out next to me. Of course he decided. But I'm warning you, it's dangerous out there. Oh my god, this fucking Why is game. Briscoe's voice acting so bad? How long is this game? I've saved a lot. Well, this is also an old game, so I feel yeah. like anything that was important, they're going to let you save. Yeah, well, I mean, obviously there's no in... I guess there's, like, quote-unquote levels, but I just, like... Have you lost weight? Me? Random question. Yes, you. I don't... If I have, I have no idea how. I've literally done the opposite of what you do to lose weight, which is not exercise 
and drink a shit ton of soda. I mean, I've, I mean, I've, I've been at work, but that's like the closest thing to exercise I've gotten. It's at least two hours. This is a three-hour stream. <laughs> well, well, we'll see what happens. I mean, I guess the only people that can technically die are the reporters, right? <laughs> like. Well, shit, I mean... Good evening, everybody. This is Carly Reese. Our news team received a telephone call. There's suspense. It seems Creeping an old up. man has been left behind at a nursing home. Here we are now at is the Is that a frog or an home. alien? It's a grasshopper. He's got the two the antennae. For the elderly gentleman. It's hard to see because... Right. It, yeah. Oh. Is somebody there? Help! <laughs> Over there? Can I move? I can't move. Oh, there we go. Jesus Christ. Dang. Carly? And Briscoe, too? What the fuck? What the fuck? I'm going in. What on earth happened? <laughs> Who did this to you? I don't know. How am I not getting E points? No <laughs> the fuck? I was at the office when somebody said I'm trying to be a pervert. Oh, Give me E points. When I came to, I was here like this. Jesus Christ. Please, out of these things. Look, Look at those huge cuffs. Holy shit. Guess? I have to point at these for you to. He must be quite the sadist. Frisco, shut Just up. Hang on. We'll get you free from there. But how do these unlock? Oh, God. I fucking yeah. hope so, my dude. Oh, Just I hope so. <laughs> I'm going to try to save her. Some way to do it. All right. Oh man, I hope so. Hold on. Moon says get her face. Get her face. Oh, you know what? That actually makes sense. Like zoom in and then should I do the Well you got the, the orange thing, you know? Yeah. Hmm. I know we gotta set her free. But Oh Let's go. no. <laughs> I I feel a little bad about now because of his lead up. Like if I could just do it, it'd be one thing, but Well, here I go. Frisco, you fucking slime ball. Look around the room and see if there's like anything, I guess. Since focusing I on our faces and doing Yeah, cuz it's just going to give you this dialogue right. again. God, when can we get Frisco killed? <laughs> Oh no! Oh no! Oh wait! Don't don't worry about it. It looks like there aren't even enough balls to play nine ball. I got a couple of balls to play. You could use both of yours. Odd, isn't it? I would could. Let's go look for the missing. There's balls. a puzzle with the balls. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, Judd, around yeah. the room, my yeah, guy. I'm trying to. I'm trying to cancel. What can I cannot cancel out? Oh well. Oh. Okay. Listen, I'm trying to get E points, man. Yeah, it's not fucking working. You're just getting suspense points. Jesus. Oh god. my god, that's the fucking puzzle, isn't it? It's gonna be exactly like Dead Prime, where they just give you the goddamn answer. Is it in the ballroom? Are the balls in the ballroom? Oh, well, look at that. Grab that. Jesus Christ, that zoomed in so hard. It's the nine ball. Yeah, it is, bud. Imagine being so stupidly evil that you're like, yes, during this Stephen King bullshit alien invasion outbreak, I'm going to set up a puzzle that can uh -oh. only be solved by finding the missing billiard balls and also for some reason strapping a non-disclosed affiliated character onto a pool table. Avery, also, I if somebody strapped somebody to my billiard table, I'd be pissed. Those things are so expensive to level. Avery, one, hello, two, I, you've missed things, but I don't know how to describe it. I'm trying to be a pervert and failing, because this... Yeah, like, it's actually pretty impressive how badly it's he's no failing use. at being a perv. It won't open. Like, there's a sliding scale at the top. There's something important in there. 
where like E means erotic and S means suspense, and suspense is like when you're focusing on like the story shit. And I've looked at so much butt and boob, and it just will not give me E points. I also have no idea what the fuck is going on. Oh. We're trying to solve the mystery. Oh, yeah, the mystery. Oh, dear. Oh, hey, dear. Billiard balls. Oh, God. Man, there's another dead body here. Boy, I wish it was Frisco. Basically, the basically the plot is like the mist. It seems like so far where there's just monsters coming out of the mist and they hey, fucking people look, up. There's a ball. There oh is. Oh my god! Can we ball. just accidentally shove Frisco off the stairwell? God, I have, I have tried. Is that an option? I have literally tried to like run into him. <laughs> <laughs> Get fucked on. Like watch. And now he's standing on the dead body. Oh shit! Yeah, it worked this time. Fuck you, Briscoe. <laughs> Here, this is, this is giving me a ride points. Oh my god. I tried to beat- Oh, that red bar is from ramming people, right? Okay. I tried to beat his ass earlier, but... Yeah, I think you have to look at the door again. Yeah, I know, I was just... So much of this game, I feel like, is a really cool idea. Like... The cameraman looking at the things that need to be done, I think, is pretty cool. I just don't feel like it's executed that well. You guys understand two things. One, I mean, obviously it's a PS2 game. Two, this is a Suda 51 game. Yeah. So it, it's, I, I, with the exception of, like, no more heroes, it's very much going to be, like, kind of janky. But, like, it's not, it's not the, it's the same energy as Dead Prem, but it's not the same, obviously. I don't know how to describe it. More conceptual, I guess, than nature. Boy, I can't wait to play an actually scary game with you. Well, shit, if this game only takes two hours... Might happen. Yeah. Maybe maybe we'll be starting fucking... Silent Hill earlier than I anticipated. Oh, boy. I felt Lavery's Silent Hill boner erect from here. Because I, 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 I did say before I wanted to take a break, but I also didn't think this was going to be two hours long. Oh, dear. Oh, the ball's floating in there. I'm zoomed in and I can't... Okay, whatever. I am so fucking excited to play Silent Hill with you, Judd. Huh? Like, that water sure is a nasty color. So fucking excited. I wonder if there's anything in it. Why don't I try pulling the plug? We could play oh, the God. shitty Silent Hill, and by we I mean you, because I will never control that game again as long as I fucking live. I'm playing Silent Hill 1. Another ball. <laughs> that, that's the one we're playing. No, so Silent Hill 1 is the good one. The shitty one is Homecoming. Right. And I'm saying I'm not saying that's off the table. I'm saying I have not actually played any Silent Hill ever. Right, so. but if you wanted to just do a goofy one that you could drop at any point in time, Homecoming is the one. Okay. Which... Is Homecoming, what's that for? Uh, Xbox 360 and PC. They are still charging $60 for the PC version, which I think is bullshit because that game is barely worth 6 Then, I'm, then we're definitely and not... you know what? All $6 of that goes to Akira Yamaoka. The rest of it, fuck it. Forever oh. Disappointed Homecoming is the last one that Akira Yamaoka was on for. Hey! Doesn't this wall look a little too new here? Oh, wow, we found a hidden wall. I can't tell. Okay. Well, it you guys need to tell me how to crouch then. in um, erotic e-points, mostly gained by crouching and filming up if the skirt of the reporter, tool, also gained by finding down. pornography. Well, oh, shit, I'll be looking out for that. You can win the high E unlockable like easily during the reporter's long talks to camera. It's pretty much an infinite resource. Oh, well, that's kind of lame. The problem is... You all need to tell me what button to press to crouch because they have not told me in game how to crouch. I, I pressed... truthfully do not know if it works on Steam Lavery. I would not be surprised if you would install it and it just CTDs immediately. D pad, according to Aisha. I ho is it Aisha or Aisha? All right, hold on. I was I was in a room transition before. Now I can't move. Look! Now I can't move at all. That chandelier is swaying. Yes. Oh my yes, 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 yes. 
Falling her. Falling her. It'll crash right onto Justine. Oh my. Let's hurry. Oh, let it fall. <laughs> oh god, which way do we go? Judd, I'm going to be a her buttons. Make everyone die. Oh, we went the wrong way. Yeah, she's fucked. <laughs> Someone clip my fucking ridiculous begging for this chick Ooh. to die. Oh, I forgot I could press fucking triangle to go back, so I'm wasting time for nothing, too. Oh, really? Fuck, I- she is- she is done dead, I can't. What is that, um... Those there's like a box. very cliche anime picture of like the person grabbing their face and they have like the very long nails and there's like blood and everybody uses it for yandere. You're saying things, but things are happening, like music cues. Oh god. Right. Dead body. Oh. It's empty. Oh, there's gonna be one downstairs apparently. Oh. That would have been such a good spot though for a jump scare. Oh, there's the crouch. Into it. There's the crouch. The cabinet is a good one to look at if I remember right for this room, says Moon. Yeah, but listen, I, they told me how to crouch now. And look, you're still getting suspense points. I guess she's wearing pants. That was the cabinet. Uh, when we look at it again, it's empty. Look for a switch. Um. Uh, There's... Oh, fuck, where am I? Um, in Chicago, according to the intro. Well, she's just gonna shut it. I don't know. Is there a switch on, like, the side, maybe? Oh, fuck, if Briscoe get out of the way, I can tell you. There's, like, that's, eight... gotta, that's gotta be, like, a secret passageway kind of bullshit, you know what I mean? There's no... I think she's, uh, Moon says it's in the room somewhere. The switch. Okay. It's what I figured. I thought it was going to be somewhere else in the room, and then... A book? A lamp? This lamp. I wonder if it works. Girl, you got... Did you just hear a strange noise? Jesus Christ. <laughs> from inside the armoire. Dead body, dead body, dead body, dead body. Sound came from inside this? Come on, dead body, please. Come on, Come on Carly. You can open this. Sound came from inside this thing. Believe in you. Oh, oh. Mr. Briscoe, oh. there's a room back there. Not, okay. So Bloody handprints. Even better. Bloody fucking handprints. Time to uh. Huh? Oh. Oh. Imagining things. Oh. Is that supposed to be a ghost? Uh. Look at that low res ghost. Oh dear, that's actually creepy to me. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no. Carly, I need Carly, I need comfort, please. <laughs> Carly, please. You've got a dirty mind, don't you? Oh shit! That's what happens when I see ghosts, Carly. Oh God. I got acknowledged for my being a pervert. It's the four ball! Hey, Monica, I saw that thing you posted where it's like, are you an introvert or an outvert? And she responds, I'm a pervert. Great. <laughs> that is hilarious. How about that? I know someone's life is at stake. Let's go. Oh, uh, what a horrible game. It's been, it's been, it's been an adventure. To say the least. 
We're probably too late. Probably fucking dead. Which now that I realize we could just oh shit. You probably have to focus on the actual puzzle. Oh yeah, Carlos or uh, Briscoe's just gonna nut. Admit this, but uh, I'm getting kind of excited. Oh no! Please murder this man. I don't think. I don't the think fucking, the fucking porno sounds are killing me. You know what? I know I said I've been trying to get E points, but I don't know if I can actually do this with him tagging along, right? Try the it, it's in gross. The yeah. Oh, Christ. Do you remember what the thing was? Nope. I'm pretty sure it was one. It's definitely one, two, four. Because I remember being really annoyed that it wasn't one, two, three. And I think the yellow Six. one is at the bottom, and I think the magenta one's in the middle. Sorry, I'm just making sure. Okay, I guess I just have that. Because it was it was set up like a like a nine rack. All right, swap the seven and the nine. Oh. Yeah, a lot happened in between. Then I was like. All right, leave leave it nope. and see if it'll confirm. No, it's good. You good? Okay. Damn, I really wanted that fucking chandelier to fall on her. Hey, wait, there's time. Except for this one in the bottom right. Okay, hang on. Look up. I'll get you off. Oh, this is a cussy knife. Oh, I wanted to fall. I wanted to fall so bad. Uh. Put her balls in the rack. Oh, we got her. God damn it. Creepy Briscoe. I'm alright. I can get up by myself. Damn it, Briscoe. Why didn't you die? If I could just be a silent protagonist pervert, it'd be great, but he's fucking... Oh, she's... I really like her. Oh, you got a little kiss on the cheek. Eat shit, Briscoe. He, fuck you, Briscoe. <laughs> Imagine... In context, that's hilarious, because Bruce Briscoe's skeevy, but, like, in context, in-universe, I've been literally crawling on my stomach oh now. Goodness, you're safe now Jackie. Like, looking at her butt. But, <laughs> but what? That elderly gentleman, the one that called us asking for help. Oh my god, you dumb bitch. I didn't think there was anybody here. Y'all have the same voice? But nobody answered me or came to help. You shouldn't die, Briscoe. But there should be an old man here somewhere. That's the reason we came, because he called us. Old man? No, I tell you, I didn't see anyone. I don't know anything, not even where this is. Okay. That telephone call. I wonder if Fuck it was a trick to lure us here. But why? What good would that do anyone? Look, how should I know? I... But I guess you're right. I'm hoping... I guess we better get out of here. That this whole thing started because some old man got bored in a nursing here. home. And was like, I'm gonna summon the occult. Justine, you wait here until we make there's a, safe, okay? This oh, I only remember this because there's an old man. But there's a very charming, but also really cool. Let's go look for an escape route. Cyberpunk comedy adventure anime. I think it's called Raijin Z. And it's basically about this: the spirit of this old woman gets uploaded into this AI that this health AI that is like it's supposed to um. Like, it's the future, so the old man's, like, in the nursing home, and he's set up to, like, a future bed that, you know, takes care of him physically. And it has okay. an AI, but his his late wife's spirit gets put up into the AI. And so she literally, like, tears him him and the bed out and starts becoming this bio... Not biomechanic, but, like, you know, it's it's this, it's this thing where, where, like, they keep pulling other machine parts in and making a bigger machine out of it, and the old man's at the center. Mm -hmm. And of course, the military and everybody's like trying to stop it because it's wrecking everything. But this AI is just like my my hu my husband and I just want to would like to go to the beach. So it's just like tearing through ass through city to just go to the fucking beach. But she wants to go to the beach with her husband. And I'm like, that's fucking adorable. And he's he's super old, so he's like, oh, I want to go to the beach. 
And uh, it was like a 90s anime, so the animation was like stupid good. Uh, In my restless dreams, I see that now. Brisco, what the fuck? <laughs> Brisco, get out of my fucking face. Fuck Brisco, for real though. Let's go. Right, let's go find this old man who's assur assuredly not hooked up to his lovely AI wife. Put just random memo at look memo ass looking things there when Oh, yeah, this is the ballroom. Oh, okay, hold on. I gotta focus in on you. Where are we Where are we going? Where do I go? Do I go up the stairs? Go this way? I go this way. Dude, I'm so fucking hungry right now. Holy shit. Oh, did I tell you that uh, the reason it took so long at the dealership to get my loaner car was because I went to the wrong waiting room? Really? <laughs> I went to the place that was labeled waiting room. And, <laughs> which is where I usually go to hang out when I'm just dropping off something for like, you know, like an oil change or something that's particularly quick. Yeah. And I, like, they were slammed when I got there. There was several cars in the little like, port the carport they use for people to bring their stuff in for service so i didn't really think anything of it until i was like wow it's been a while so i went up to the front and i was like i've been waiting for like 40 minutes and i just wanted to know like how long i might be waiting for so i can let people know and she was like i'm so sorry we were looking for you and i was like the waiting room the place with the waiting and finally got like everything sorted out but she was like apologizing profusely. I'm like, it's fine. Trust why? me, I get it. Like, why are there two wait? Why do they just have two waiting rooms? Also, because they have things spread out because of COVID. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, it makes sense. Now that so, makes sense. Yeah. What the fuck do I do here? The, the my 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 door opener is not going. I do not agree with that kitchen design, says Lavery. Funnily enough, I agree. I don't want to push. I don't. I feel bad. What do I have? Okay. Are there any more of those like focus point things? Oh god. Uh, I'm gonna go to the kitchen again. So there was like a memo on the table. Oh shit. Which actually is nothing. That's uh, a huge fucking fridge. There's a big old fridge. There's the ballroom. Uh, I don't think there's nothing else out. Maybe we just need to leave. There's this door here. Oh, this is the billiards room. Maybe we can, uh... Okay. So what Moon remembers is there's, like, a room you need to go to and ask her to open it via finding it. Okay. Okay, this is, this is just the poster on the wall thing. Which is then a terrifying boss in a garage. Oh, oh lovely. Solid. I got, I, got mental, I got a certain mental map in here. Alright. So this door's a no-go. Can't go back in the billiards room. No other doors in here. Kitchen has... Fuck all. This is the... That's where we found one of the balls. I'm gonna check in here one more time just to make sure I didn't miss a... Door. Not nah, Briscoe, get out of my way. Uh... Now... We're gonna go upstairs. At these two rooms. So. Not this one. The reason that Avery has not been participating in chat is apparently because she put a six pack of Dr. Pepper in her fridge and it froze. And one of Amazing. them exploded. <laughs> All over her fridge. Oh, Avery. I think I found the door because nothing's happening, but I also can't escape. Oh, there's the sound of something happening in theory. I guess I'll just wait here for. I guess I'll just wait here. I guess I'll just wait here for Carly. If I could stay here. The least Briscoe could do is open doors for me. The least Briscoe could do is just not exist. But if I'm gonna be if I'm gonna be saddled with him, at least open some fucking doors. <laughs> Avery, I'm oh. getting agitated just looking at that picture of the fridge. I hope. 
god that doesn't get sticky and gross for you because that's the worst okay nothing happened at all uh if that's why you don't put sodas in the freezer it's also why you can't put like beer in the freezer Maybe that's fucked up. I agree. I just I'm so focused on doors right now. It was this. It's a six pack of uh, aluminum cans, and yeah, when you put like the aluminum cans in the freezer and stuff, that weld that's on the top that keeps the top part on will just fucking boost. I know it's the fridge, but like if you have an older fridge, the top rack is going to get way cold because it's by the freezer. Like that's just how they are. They're just not designed well. I, hmm. I love how I'm arguing with Avery about kitchen stuff and Judd's just stuck. Beauty. So, I don't know what the fuck to do. Yeah, in our fridge, it's like if you put it anything along the wall that connects to the freezer, it's just done. Yeah, but uh, it's not well insulated. Avery. Oh my god. I'm telling you. F fuck the fucking freezer right now. Where do I go? Fuck, fuck freezers. Moon's looking it up for you. Jesus Christ. This one, this is weird, like, Wait, nothing can happens. You, can, you, can you crouch under the boxes in the room under the stairs? It's a good idea. Let me try that. Crouching can be used for other things than perversion. Let me I try that. I cannot believe that the sequel to the Great Steak Debate is the Great Fridge Debate. <laughs> I can't remember where that is, because I dismissed that room. I think it's just around here, yeah. <laughs> Marco says Judd gonna fight a freezer. Yeah, that kind of looks like something you might be able to, like, crouch into. Oh, is that the porn? Did I at least find porn? Is, is this- Do I have to, like- oh. Jesus Christ, hold on. <laughs> okay, I cannot crawl under here, for one. I'm pretty sure that's porn. Oh, you know what? Hold up. Hold up, though. Ram it. Maybe ran the tilted one? Nope. There's just random ass magazines that I can't get to. <laughs> Throw Briscoe at it, yeah. Moon says go and talk to the girls. But for how? I've clicked on this woman so many times. Click on the other woman. She doesn't have a prompt. Oh, are you oh. fucking kidding me, dude? <laughs> hey, look. There's something on the floor. It's a key. A moon is also saying with the boss, they're bulletproof, so you gotta shoot a gas I can behind them. Door it opens. Suck my fucking nards. Fuck my my nards and my schlong. That's bullshit. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> I love how. Yeah. <Ew. laughs> nope. <laughs> Bye. Now we gotta go in. All right. Jesus Christ. Ah! <laughs> Are you oh fucking serious, Briscoe? Oh, Briscoe, you useless fuck. The gas can? Look at it just fucking swivel. You dead? No, but she did have a green prompt on her. Ah, fuck. Girl? Fuck. You're gonna like walk right into that fucking monster. Yeah, she's. <laughs> oh my god, this is. She's dead, dude. Like, I can't. Is that a baby at the tip of the thing? No, don't worry about it. Oh, you had to trigger that in order to get the fucking gas can. Okay. Oh, you did it. No, I did not. She shot the gas can. Oh my god, what the fuck? Briscoe, get the fuck out the way, dude! Oh, shoot the light bulb. 
No, there's nothing. Nothing is happening. Just focus on the light bulb. Dude. I'm... The light bulb. There you go. Buttons. You can't lock onto things if it doesn't let you. I'm, I don't know how to explain this without you controlling it, but I can aim at the light bulb all I want. But if it doesn't prompt, it won't go. Also, I didn't shoot a gas. I didn't prompt a gas can at all. She just kind of did it. Game controls are not great. Oh. Okay. How you doing? There's a prompt over here, but I don't. What the? It's, it's shit like that, too. So that's a good example, right? There was a green prompt on this thing. And now I can't do it because Briscoe's in the way. Oh, see see how that's green on that thing? Yeah. Watch. Boop. That's, that's my hitbox. Is this fucking whole cube of area. Also, Moon says, so the reason Carly took so long is that she was going back to her spot. She has a specific spot that she has to stand to to shoot for some odd reason. Okay. That might just be, like, old PS games. I don't think there's anything to do with that so much as just, this is just an, a weirdly made game anyways. There's not a lot of game. There's no games like this on the PS2 that I can tell. Reminder for the entire group about the Humble Pathfinder bundle. Oh, I already got that. But yeah, if you haven't gotten it yet. Totally not alt-tabbing to also do that during this. Alright, let's get out of here. Where do you want to go? I wonder if the I'm more confused because, like, it, the, I don't know what the gas can did. I didn't. I didn't. I thought I was going to be focused on gas cans and making her shoot those. Everybody to go home. Cute. I stayed and saw everybody else off personally. I bet that they're all with the families now and that they've already escaped the city. We ought to escape too. I'm worried. Follow about me. Set me free. For me. I'm up in her butt and I'm getting more then suspense points. Justine home first. You can just take me as far as you're going. Follow you me. Sure? Yeah, I'll be fine. And by the way, Mr. Briscoe, our other teams that got sent out, the ones that haven't oh, come back to the office yet, yeah. they might still be here in the city, don't you think? This is We'd better good. find out. Gotta follow my Son rainbow. Are you serious? I know where Kristen's team is anyway. He got word there was a monster in the old Miller family mansion. He took his team over there to cover the story. I got so many suspense points. Mr. Briscoe, we should go there too. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> That felt pretty fucking genuine, I'm not gonna lie. Holy shit. God damn it. <laughs> that's so fucking- That's like the only good piece of voice acting he's had. Oh, man. Frisco County Jr. over here. The only thing I'm stuck on for this this humble bundle is i'm not sure i want a physical copy of the core rulebook because i have so many fucking rulebooks right now this is Carly Reese. that book is like 50 to 60 bucks normally though i know because the first dead one was not cheap some of our colleagues may have been left behind in this mansion we're just about to i bought it i wanted i wanted a physical copy anyways but i actually had most of the pdfs already so i'm just like i was like fuck man that's a good deal i'm, I'm struggling if I want it be like it's the too much shit oh. thing going on. Oh, well, Freeze. that's a weird ass Pokemon. A right in front of us. Oh, oh, this is. I'm moving on my own now. It's not moving. I bet it would if we got too close. Well, so I can give you a copy of the PDF if you want to look it over and make a decision it's based on that. It's not that I don't want, like, I'm going to buy it because I want to support Path, like, I want to support it. Make sure um, stay back. it's the, right. I feel like I have too much crap between all of my crap, which I know is illogical. It's because I've been cooped up in my room for the past 
however many months. Also, the shelf that I have all of my rule books on is kind of bowing. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, that's a. <laughs> I noticed that the other day when I reorganized them so I could fit even more on because we got the labyrinth Kickstarter in. Yeah. And I was like, huh. This is, um. Uh. Uh. M fucking excuse me? Right. Yeah, the, la the labyrinth. Oh. Yeah, so I had to like move all of my books over so they're like actually on the brace. And I just like stacked them. Right. But I'm like, huh. And I have some I haven't even gotten in yet from Kickstarter. Look so the basement. Wanna go down? I don't think I will. I get claustrophobic in basements. Oh. Okay, we're gonna well we're gonna look around here first, guys. Okay, Labor. Remind me and I will. Newspaper from a week ago. The headline says, "Research director of Zaka Bio Labs fired." Oh my god! This is a fucking Res Evil knockoff. This city is called Zaka. No, we're in Chicago. It, but we're Zaka News, and this is Zaka Research. Maybe it's just one conglomerate that owns everything, like Fox. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Yeah, it's funny, um, in our group chat when I was like, if we ever do an RPG stream, I don't want to play Pathfinder, that was a little bit of a misnomer, so I actually meant Pathfinder 1st Edition. <laughs> I'd be su super down to play, to try out 2nd. I'd be super down to be on a fucking RPG stream. The only condition is you have to accept bad accents, because that's like my shtick. <laughs> Well, I mean, we're like I like I said before, we're we're far away from that for not like super far, but I got first I got to move, then I got to figure out what my schedule's like. Oh my fucking god. Eumonica said you ladder. might call it an umbrella seem corporation. To be special about it. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Numana, you're the best. I hate it. I hate I hate this. I don't hate Pneumonica, I just hate the joke. Do, do we want to start Silent Hill or do we want to start Resident Evil? Ooh. So here's the... So, so, so alright, on the level. If we do... Wait. What do you mean I did my best impression of Molly from Sailor Moon? I, what? Anyway. She's um, right over there! Sorry. <laughs> if we did Res Evil, I'd actually want to play that because I have not controlled Res Evil before. Okay. So uh, Silent Hill might be the better bet. Actually, it's it's funny. I actually haven't played. I've never actually controlled Res Evil either, but I'm I'm familiar with the story beats, so I'm good with that. Also, something I just thought of too is that there's a lot mainline game wise. It's really like what one to three that people suggest. I mean, I know there's other Silent for Hill what games. Silent Hill or Res yeah, Evil for Silent Hill. It's a toilet. I would say like the there isn't anything special about it. Sorry. The ones that I see get recommended all the time on the subreddit, and the ones that I would agree with are one, two, three, maybe four if you're feeling it, but you have to go into it recognizing that it wasn't meant to be a Silent Hill game when they were devving it. Yeah. And Shattered Memories. Right. Usually it is two th through four, Lavery, when people are recommending to play the OG ones because the discs for Silent Hill Zero, like... Are like two hundred dollars. Oh, and, and most people, yeah, and most most people don't like the newer games. Four kind of has a cult following. Four is a good fucking game. It's just not like yeah. I wish they had not made it a Silent Hill game. Um, I think it would have stood so much better on its own had it just yeah. been The Room and not Silent Hill Four. The Room. It's okay. the same way I feel about Downpour. Downpour is a decent game. It just should not have been Silent Hill. Can I just check this door? What the fuck? Homecoming, however. Homecoming is garbage. Fun. Coming up here. What's that? Oh, there we go. Jesus Christ. On top of the armoire. Theo, that, I think that's a good plan. Uh, a for so that you can play the first game. B, at least for my stream, like we're talking three, maybe four games versus like eight. No, like. 
versus 10 if you count the new one coming out. I, got, I still got to play RE7. I have it on PlayStation. Now, nah, play, play, play the others first. Yeah. But I got it because it was like in one of those like used. Oh, yeah, yeah, things. of course. Can't reach it. Oh, hold up. Okay, okay, hold up. Hold up, guys. I got an idea. If we use this, use the step ladder. We'll be able to see the top of the armoire. Yeah, that's how step ladders work. The puzzles in this are so dumb. <laughs> I'm I'm actually glad this is a two hour game. I don't think I could take more than two hours to be honest. I love that Deke Molly's Maybe voice just sounds like Discount Harley house. Quinn. Yeah. Alright. Get out of here, finally. God, I love that shitty, like, Discount Harley Quinn accent, too. I, uh... I know there's been some problematic shit in it, uh, so I'm not suggesting the show. I do gotta say though, I like the voice actress for that Harley Quinn show that streamed on DC Universe. I I recognize that aspects of it are problematic. I still really like that show, and I have a hard time justifying that. Oh, I, all I was gonna say was um, I like that her voice is like vaguely has that accent, but it's not like nobody comes between me and my pudding. Like she she uses that accent on purpose when like referring to the Joker, early like earlier on when she's like still kind of into him, and then later when she's like fucking with him. And I'm like I super appreciate that. Like I fucking love the I love the clip so much of her and Pamela, where Pamela's like, "Hey, I'm gonna go get Thai food. What do you want? Text it to me." And they have that whole discussion about like how you need to text things because you won't remember. And I'm, I, I feel it in my soul. Like, <laughs> you could tell me to my face, hey, do this thing. But if it is not written down by the time I get there, it's fucking gone. Oh my god, we're packing heat now. Yeah, I think like, I think the show's heart is in the right place because I've seen them tackle like misogyny and shit like that. I think it's just, like, it, it just fucks like it up suffers. sometimes. It suffers the same shit that, like, every other mainstream fucking big comic shit does. Like, not that that excuses it, but I'm almost like, yeah, it's gonna happen. It's so much easier when they don't move. Yeah, I completely agree. Awesome. Moon says, I just checked our playthrough and it's nearly four hours. Huh? Oh. I'm not sure, blah, blah, you might want to cut it off if you want to play something that won't melt your brain. Like we're no, I can, I can... I can do this for the stream, especially if there's only going to be, like, a little bit left. In heaven. <laughs> okay, the dude. Fuck, Briscoe? Hell. Oh, wow, Briscoe. Phew. That was amazing. Clearly she's an American. Fires one shotgun and she's like, oh yeah, this is the shit. Also, um, hey, Judd. Yeah. Do you know that you have Ultraman spelled wrong in your description? It says oh. one lone Ultraman. Oh, thanks for that. I guess I, <laughs> I wonder if I should, I, should I leave it for Legacy. For like six weeks, and I've just noticed it. Man, should, I wonder <laughs> if I should leave it for Legacy purposes. Uh, Lee is actually going to work on a. I commissioned them for um. New actually Ultraman inspired esque stream artwork. Oh fuck yeah. I think I'm gonna do like an Ultraman video game stream and like a con like an Ultraman Con Rider Godzilla stream. You'll have to let me know with... when you do that so I can send the link to my mother and one teach her how to use Twitch and then yeah. two so she can watch. I'll definitely play the one Ultraman game for the SNES that came to America. And then some random random stuff. It's no use it won't open. Okay, relax, Carly. <laughs> Calm your tits. Holy Carly. shit, It'll dude. It'll be okay. We got another door right here, baby girl. It's gonna be fine. <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy. Uh. Alright, Carly, look. Here's... Never mind. 
Fuck it. Do we have the do we have the pole bot in Gog? Cog. I don't know. I don't think general I don't think general dispot does. Basically, I need somebody else to make the decision for me of whether I get the physical book or not. <laughs> Just get the physical book. And I'll tell you why. One, it's cheap. And two, it's for, like, a good cause, so. Yeah, that's valid. I would say don't do it if you're generally worried about money in any case. <clears throat> but, yeah, I mean, you can, you, can, you can find a place for, you can find a place for it. I, I, I don't think one book is going to make your whole thing come toppling down. Boy, I can't fucking wait for it to just rip out of the wall. <laughs> well, if it does, I'll be like, oh well. It's another bathtub. Right onto my fucking Maybe monitor. We'll something if we pull the plug. You message me and tell me that, I'd be like, life's rough. <laughs> I, would, I would honestly just tackle. I don't know. It's funny how I went through a period where, like, I had zero interest in D&D, &D, where I was like, fuck D&D. &D. And then I got into a period of my life where, like, where D&D is still not my favorite system overall, or, or, or type of system. But not only did I get interested in D&D &D again, but, like, in all variations of it. Including... Honestly, that's how I'm starting to feel with fucking Pathfinder. Because, like, we've had the discussion about my hatred of Pathfinder. And I'm starting to really, like... Just because you don't like the reporter doesn't... Oh, I missed it. Sorry. I'm really starting to groove with it. It's the artwork that... For me... Because, honestly, they, they, do, they do fix some things. Or streamline some things. I shouldn't say fix. They streamline a lot of things. But it's still got, I'd still say it has all the pitfalls, same pitfalls of like the 3.5 system. What grooves yeah, with me great. is one, the artwork. Two, they, um, this door. guys, it's still locked. It's locked oh, never mind. Um, they take so much inspiration from other sources. Like they take they take more inspiration away from things than a uh, normal D and D. Like, I've seen the Mothman and Chupacabra and like all kinds of cryptids in the Beastary, the different classes and stuff like that. Uh, I also really like the the campaign setting that comes along. If you get the campaign setting book, it's like oh, dear, sorry, I got distracted by this. Um, the campaign setting is like very pulpy. And like it's a genre mashup. What's that? So like you can do just classic Tolkien Mr. fantasy Henning. with it. Okay, this guy who's Mr. Henning? Carly, is that you? What are you doing here? I right, fuck Pathfinder, Mr. Henning's dying. Yes, it's me. We came to rescue you. Oh hang on now, sir. Oh I I... I was a fool. Is that Let voice actor York? team get killed. What kind of director am I, anyway? I don't think so. It you sounds really close. Anything. It wasn't your fault. Miss dying. It's all too... strange. What's happening here in Chicago? And what Zaka is doing, too? I don't know the details, but... Okay, Zaka is a conglomerate. Jeff might know something. Lately, the chief's been sending Jeff out on special assignments. What the fuck is wrong with me? Jeff went to St. Matthew's Church. <laughs> this man's she dying. Up, and there's your, here's her butt. Went there and you're still getting suspense points. I am. Oh, what a mysterious Jogo. Could you do me a favor? Tell my wife something. Tell my me. wife I said hello. Going someplace far away to do a story, and I won't be back. Dude, I'm telling your wife you fucking died. Tell her it's my lucky break. Biggest scoop of my life. Mr. Wow, between his voice actor being kind of okay. And that being just so bad. 
and, and, and by him not being Briscoe, like, I actually feel kind of bad for this guy. Okay. Even though I don't know who he is. All right. Come on. Let's go to the church. Oh, okay. <laughs> I can't believe that computer wasn't a thing. There's so many items that you were like, oh, this is obviously something to zoom in on. And it's like, nope. Bacati. Good evening, everyone. Oh. I'm afraid they I committed the cardinal sin of having a black eye voiced by a white man. State of affairs. We've all lost so Come on, Briscoe? Things. Yeah. Shit, I could have told you that. <laughs> a horrible state have you heard? <laughs> like, listen, just listen to his voice. We're here at St. Matthew's Church, but we've all but given up hope. Zaka TV viewers, this may be my last report. Carly Reese signing off. Sorry, I didn't mean to zoom in. I didn't mean to zoom in on your crotch while you were like, I'm gonna die soon. Tentacle potatoes incoming. Okay. Look at all these dead bodies. Holy shit. Maybe Jeff's one of them. Mr. Briscoe, there's something moving up there ahead. Oh, Christ. Yes, yeah, scream and alert everything of your presence. What a smart, smart cookie. Oh. Dead. <laughs> no shit. What the fuck was that? God, the Scooby Doo sounds fucking get me. Frisco, Frisco, did you die? This person must have died a horrible death. Oh, those are suspense points. That's what that sound effect is. Amazing. All right, hold up. Yeah, there's all these dead bodies here. No. I... Is that... What the fuck? I'm stuck. That no, that's Briscoe. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. That's not a potato. That Hell is not a potato. Yeah. That was pretty sick, actually, yeah. That's the coolest creature that they've had so far. That's the one from earlier. This game reminds me of... This game reminds me of um... What? No. Okay. Holy shit, the proto-FF7 game that's, like, based on that freaky Japanese novel. Before Crisis? No, oh. um... The hell is the name of that game? The best friends played it ages ago. All right. Creepy old horror game, Just Proto FF7. Work with this Japanese novel. What can I do? It looks like there aren't any great matches for your search. Wow, even Google's like, yeah, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> what what fucking right. video game is this? Old PS1 horror game. <laughs> Parasite Eve. Oh, come on. Why can't I? What the fuck? He's literally saying, watch out above you, and I can't do anything. Oh, shit. Oh, she's dead. Oh, well, goodbye. Wow. Let's go hit him with your boom mic. Yeah, you're right. Great. That's bullshit. That's super bullshit, actually. Nah, it's fine. No, it's bull. No, nah, it's fine. Okay, if she's dead, like, what? Do I have to focus on her? That'd be fucked up. Oh, okay. She was in the She was in the floor. I didn't even see... They just showed a statue. I didn't even see what was happening. 
Moon says, damn it, that's the exact thing that's happened to us. You know what? You know what? It's Briscoe's fault. It is Briscoe's fault, but I also probably should turn my brightness up on my monitor. <laughs> maybe that'll help. My, man, maybe. All right, Carly. We got cheaped out of that one. A smidge, yeah. Yeah, because they because you you zoom up and there's a giant statue and it says "Look out from above." So I'm thinking debris or something, right? <laughs> and then all oh, surprise, there's little two little trilopods just chilling. Oh, the shipping for my book is only going to be like nine dollars. That's not bad at all. Yeah. If it was bad shipping, I would have told you. That's like that's about how much I'd pay if I was paying for shipping on like thrift books or. Yeah. Um, oh, also, I really appreciate. I was checking this out. the The official Pathfinder um, character sheet pack comes with custom class base sheets. Fuck yeah, that's which, the best shit. Yeah. I have a set of those for fifth edition, and it's made it so much easier for my newer players. Yeah. Sorry about this. If Unfortunately, the actual sheet overall, at least for me, it's not bad, but initially, like, on first look, the sheet makes me, like, kind of, my eyes roll the back of my head. Um, <laughs> just, truthfully, there's a lot of feats. Truthfully, of, yeah. that's how I feel about the Warhammer 2E character sheet. Right. There's something about that character sheet that I look at, and I'm just like, this is garbage. Like, yeah, I, I know I've seen worse. I just, um... God, you know, since we've been playing it, the best character sheets are Monster, Monster of, the of the Week, and by extension, yep. all powered by the Apocalypse. Those are really good character sheets. Way. It's what? totally not, like, instinctive to what I would think of to be a character sheet, just because of playing things like Dungeons & Dragons. But yeah, it's probably like the simplest way to go. I mean, it's literally just a checklist, and you mark off the box, and you then you go, oh, what's, what did I mark off? And D&D it's... Beyond is just like basically ranked D&D. &D. Like, that's that's really all it is. Oh my god, oh, it's that's just the RPGA? Yeah. Oh fuck, I had no idea. I... I like I like the idea of competitive scenarios in the sense of um really tough scenarios. But I really don't like the idea of like with Zaka TV? What are you doing here? Did Dwight ask you to come? No. I just we had a little car crash. You're very the, hot. Like two, the two times I've tried to do D D beyond it's been so deplorable because the entire group just wants to min max everything and it's just not fun. Yeah, because they're playing competitive like they're playing competitive D D in the sense of they're trying to win points. And I think that's fucked up. But I can't remember I have a love hate relationship with that viewpoint though, anyways though. Like I, I saw this tweet from this person being like, Oh, how dare I not min max my character? And I don't I didn't say anything, I didn't enter the conversation because I'm like, how do I explain to somebody without being a douche that this scumbag system will punish you actively later on for not doing that without sounding yeah. like a tool, you know what I'm saying? It's like, uh, yes, it's you, like, sh like, you should have the right to do it your way. The whole, like, min-maxing competitive culture because is the reason why I don't, like, did not like Pathfinder and refused to play it for, yeah. uh, going on 10 years? I mean, if you have a DM who's, like, not a dummy, do you know him? like, you'll be okay. I do. Right? He and I go They'll just fudge rolls or whatever, or whatever they gotta do. At the same time, you see. Um, or at least, like, not super penalize you, but... But yeah, that competitive bullshit is just... It's just stupid to me in principle. It's like, oh, we're gonna compete to see who role-played this adventure the best, and who completed this adventure the best. And, like, if you have a good DM, you can inculcate that naturally in your game. Like... Naturally. Yes, I do. Actually. You can 
Do I, the you can encourage good role playing so you through your DMing you you by either granting rewards or giving bonuses or whatever after Dwight, to the role play process. Like when I'm running family D and D, I am super loose about certain rules because we're there to have fun. We're not there to do so bullshit. To but I'll give them Here, bonuses if they role play so a scene really well. Or let's say. My brother fails yet another so, skill check, but he role plays a good scenario. I'll be like, you know what? You're know. still going to get punished because you maybe. failed the role, but it's not going to be as bad. Is, like, you, you can generate naturally He's good role playing when everybody else by back. being the DM. It doesn't always have to be the player's, to no good. Yeah. like, Doing something he didn't want omnibus? Is that the word I'm looking for? And then you showed up. Uh, no, um... I bet he hit you but I'm blinking on too, so don't worry. So where is this guy now? He's probably still somewhere nearby. Uh, the hell is the word I'm looking for? Oh! Calm down. Just go shut the fuck up. <laughs> You've literally been the loudest one this entire time. It's starting to rain. So you think this guy is nearby? I don't know. I mean, the fact of the matter is though, like, that 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 D and D is prerogative. Still, like, that is prerogative. It. Thank you. Thank you. D and D is That's still amazing. designed to just be a bunch of fights right. interconnected. Like it's, mm -hmm. it's just an excuse to have fights. So I know sometimes people get annoyed when I say it, but they're like, no, "I want to do this," do. and I I get frustrated that D and D won't do it, and I'm like, "Play a different game." So we're cut off. <laughs> yeah, like at the, like there's so many other options to D and D at this point that it's fully possible to find a system that's going to do what you want it to do. But when you're just starting out, D and D is like the only no name air quotes yeah. everywhere. We'll wait for Dwight. Yeah. Like, especially and especially doubling, like, like quadrupling now with all the like the streaming shows and stuff. Yeah. I really like the the Delta Green Call of Cthulhu we can Warhammer. I guess it's just basically the Cubicle Seven systems at this okay. point, since Cube Seven now owns all of them. But I love that stat mechanic of everything based on the D100, and you're trying to roll low. The only downside is my poor people that I play Warhammer with. I roll something, and I'm like, wait, is doubles meaning a crit in this game or in Delta Green? And every time they're like, it's Delta Green buttons. We've gone over this. Yeah, Percentile's been Percentile's been around a long time. It's not just Cubicle Seven, but yeah, they basically do. They much they seem own to have all of them now. Like they they got the One Ring, they got Warhammer. They don't have a they don't have they don't have a Club's Phase. I know Club's Phase is uh, Percentile. Well, that's true. I'm so happy they got Warhammer though. Can I tell you? I was like. I was dreading in my bones oh, fuck? that Warhammer was just going to stab oh. me and die. Am I going to take a shit? Did I just take a shit? That shower did oh. You know what, Aisha? That's a really, that's a really good point. It's like the Harley Davidson of, like, of... I guess we'd better head out then. Of roleplay games. You know, it's a super well-known brand, which people assume means they're the best, but that's not always true. And it's true. Like, if the, yeah. if you're going to buy a Harley-Davidson because you want a yeah. chopper that sounds like you're cutting down every tree right. in a 45-mile radius, oh, that's a Harley-Davidson. just need to rest. That's all. But if you go in wanting, like, a crotch rocket, you're not going to get a Harley-Davidson. Yeah. That is part of the reason why I want to play the 13th Age. Because... I want to play that so bad. Yeah. Did you hear something upstairs just now? Yeah, because like Is somebody up there. Outwardly and in the finer details, like it's like, what if we streamline and strip down? Oh, hold that thought. Hey, look at that body. No! <clears throat> Who could have done this? This is probably somewhere close. By. Almost, almost as bad as voice acting as House of the Dead. Oh man, you're so you're right. right. I'll go get the car. Like there's there's really sim there's similar cadences, but it's not it's still not as bad as that. So Marco, a crotch rocket is the type of motorcycle that um. You're thinking like a Kawasaki <laughs> Sorry, ninja. just because Marco asked that. <laughs> uh, like a Kawasaki Ninja or a Ducati Look, or most of the Hondas, where you're yeah, hunched over me, the I'm gas can, the gun. and they're usually hella fast. 
Sorry we've been talking over all the plot, but I just don't care about it. Nah, it's fuck it, it's fine. Yeah. <laughs> I really want to play the um the RPG that I backed on Kickstarter that I have the rule set for, where instead of dice rolls, it's the tarot deck. Yeah. I really want to play that. I, I fucks with games that use wildly different um. I fucks with it so hard. It's like it's like Dread where you fucking play Jenga. Yeah. That, I, I've, that slaps. Nigel I was going to run a Dread campaign and we never got around to it. I should see if he still wants to do it. Here it is. This is my I don't know how good that is for like a, a campaign campaign. Maybe like a short one. Well, so I air quotes campaign. Like yeah. it would have been like one of the family D&Ds. We just played Dread instead of D&D. &D, you know what right. I mean? Yeah. The right, when, when you say when you guys when you guys say campaign when you guys say I keep campaign I go by the textbook definition campaign. Nah. If you if you say we're playing a campaign and it's one adventure I will be like wait that's it because this is all happening. It, it's basically like I guess that's the way it is. At this point I use cam campaign to mean like one system almost like a video interlocked. Maybe the story is relayed but usually it's just the same players. Like, well, that's what a campaign is. It's a it's a series of interlocked adventures with the same players. That is yeah. literally what it is. Like, but because it's one camp, like one game system, I'm never like, oh, it has to be multiple sessions. It could just be one. But then, like, if you pick it up two years later, I'm gonna be like, oh, it's part of the campaign. <laughs> well, then by then you like, I would say, oh, she's got a big old gun. Risco. I would be like, oh yeah, it's a campaign now. I don't know, man. If I'm just, it's not a big I'm deal. I'm so excited to play our Warren campaign again. Also, that guy's dead AF. Risco, do you still feel? Dead? No, he's no. Just fucking dumb. I'm fine now. Let's head out. Is he just vibing? <laughs> yeah, I think Risco's just vibing. What was that? That triangle mechanic has not come up once. Yeah. Unless that was the thing you were supposed to do when it was like look up, and we couldn't figure out what to do. But I mashed it. I've I've been mashing it, and nothing happens. There's been a few cutscenes where I've just mashed triangle, and fair enough. Shoot it, Nina. I really like. I really like Seymour a lot. Feed me, Seymour. So, we're oh, now in Tremors, right? You did it! It's just, it's just gross nothing compared body to shit. One time. I guess kind of Tremors. I don't know. Tremors are more I like... loved our sister Bunny. So, for those unaware, Aw, that thing we so tough. at our annual <laughs> friendcation <laughs> played an RPG called The Warren, which is where you... Oh, well, get fucked on, I guess. Which is where you play um, a group of rabbits in a warren. And Avery and I had siblings where I can't remember what mine's name was and I feel so bad about that but she was obsessed with pumpkins and would constantly try to escape to the pumpkin patch to get more pumpkins and pumpkin seeds so I basically was just playing a basic white bitch wow I mashed triangle and nothing happened get get fucked on this is a cutscene these are just cutscenes wow I didn't realize oh, wow. Michael Bay directed this holy shit Holy fucking shit, the and fuck Judd is going played on? this rad buddy with like the shot. Like I remember, his know, name is Bosh. His, put some respect on the name. His name is Bosh Rutabaga. Bosh Rutabaga. I couldn't remember Rutabaga. I couldn't remember the first name, but like the deepest voice I've ever heard Judd make in my life, and it fucking shook all of us. He was a he was a warrior. So in the in, old, in, an old vet grizzled from the war. <laughs> The, the, yeah, the the rabbit wars. The so rabbit it, wars. so it was cool because like in the war and when you're up against basically predators, so like anything, you you can't actually fight with them. Like the the system assumes that any predator will like just kill you in a straight up fight. So Bosch's thing was like using the environment to just fuck their shit up. So for example, I was escorting like a mole family in the early part of the game, and there was a fox nearby. The fox leapt at me, so I told our GM, or they're just called the MC in this. I'm gonna pause it just for a sec so I can. Oh, I skipped the cutscene. I'm sorry. <laughs> Who gives a shit? You know, it's gonna be some bullshit. It's Whatever. Fun. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So I was like, I stand 
behind the hole the mole just left. And I made my roll, and then, like, the fox got their leg caught in the hole and broke it. And that was basically, like, except for the very end where, like, I got horribly injured because of some bad rolls. So I guess my rabbit is now retired, but, um... He was a grizzled vet from the the horrible rabbit war. Yeah. That Jay's old lady rabbit what the fuck horrific is trench this? warfare this memories of. Fire. Uh like you can just and the best part about the Warren and most of the games that are in that system oh God. is that get it, get it. everything is um is yeah, decided as a group huh? through role playing. So, like, the DM has yeah, vague ghosts of ideas of where things should go, but, like, you decide what your warren is. You decide what it's called. Are you city rabbits? Are you country rabbits? Where are you located? How many rabbits are you? Who's the leader of your rabbits? Who, like, you you all decide that through playing it. Like, the whole thing about the war happening, the, the, the horrible rabbit war, that came up. I was sassing you, actually, I think. Maybe. Because you had said something and I was like, you're only retired from the war. And I remember Salem going, the war? And that just like <laughs> blew yeah. into a whole thing. But like, that's okay. the glory Let's of go. role playing. In terms of like, if you want like narrative ass role playing, like, but with just enough crunch and mechanics to make it feel like you're not playing cops and robbers, I honestly think you have, you have to be okay with the fact that nine times out of ten, the books are like super specified in their concept there's a new message on the answer machine um but like i think the apocalypse world games are they're powered by the apocalypse games are like the best system they're i've ever so good powered by the apocalypse and like anything evil had us produced lately oh look it's pornography oh you found the porn finally somehow suspense is still going up riddle be this batman <laughs> jesus christ Filing cabinet. It needs many important looking documents. I've already lost my erotic points from that. Oh my god, I have to tell you I have to tell you a story offline, remind me. Remind right. me of this. Alright. <laughs> I I oh. Just oh. hold on. I, w I wonder if I will be A rat? What? And, and there was a rat there, and the, my guy just goes, a rat? So the chief's in there. They huh? just won't let Judd have a boner. Okay. Let's go in. Uh, it's just like real life. <laughs> Excuse me. I'm you... Justine Rhodes. What? Uh. What's evil lady? On? What's this disturbance? And Hell yeah, too. evil lady. What's the meaning of this? Judge shall not pass with boner. We have something very special. Like Look at how big today. that fucking desk is. Oh, you do, do you? And what might that be? Not to sound like horrible, but none of these women are wearing like. Go ahead and tell her. Obviously. Well. No, they are for the most part. I mean, it's some of it's a little like. It's your job to commute. Out. Open regulated desk, you are yes, absolutely right. right. But I mean, like... To think of it, what do I want to go out of my way to make There's no it? obvious, like... Oh, like, upskirting that you could do to get yeah. the points? Do it. Hey, hold Maybe on. right there, maybe this is my moment here. I don't want the chief mad at me either. Mm, what what are you suspense two points. whispering about? You're Damn being it. very rude, you know? Uh, all right. Fine. I'll say it then. Listen, Chief. Hmm. Let's see. Fun. Name was. Bit that fire, Briscoe. Yeah, yeah, yes. Uh, that's right, Briscoe. Uh, gee. Oh my God. I should. You know my name? Wow. Aisha says rudeness deserves to be punished. Ara ara. <laughs> You're the number one candidate for this year's Flare Award. Uh, 
God, yeah, if, if, if one of these women just pulled out Star Platinum and just bodied Briscoe, that'd be... I've been thinking about a suitable promotion for you. Wow. Uh, thank you very much, man. Oh my god, Monica just came for your fucking life. What happened to all that stuff you were saying? Oh! Right! Of course! Now, listen here, Chief! You deliberately You know, that would be... In a fucked up way, that would be a better way of events than what normally happens. Go out and stories. You unnecessarily put their lives in jeopardy. Oh, her voice absolutely does. I never demanded that the teams do anything. Just Ludes. No, this game is actually worse than Deadly Premonition. Yeah. John Philip Briscoe. Say this as a representative That's Sean Philippe, not John Philip. Oh my! Oh, don't worry, it's, it's a white guy voicing a black dude. My my! This oh my God! This actually makes it so much worse dude, that somebody coached on. this guy and was like, "I need you so to sound black for this line." Do, Damn, this is definitely a, an early Why Suda Fifty One game. It's got all of his weirdness, but not any of the good shit. Any of the good shit, yeah. You're gonna do these things, and you're gonna do them right away. You got that? And you're gonna apologize to and compensate the families of the team members who died. Okay, I'm just flinging can't. around his... I'm just, like, you to praying that this woman turns into, like, a big boss. This camera. And I'm just flinging around his There's fucking... no need for that. <laughs> All those things have already been taken care of. Mm hmm Oh, they have? Oh, you stupid simp. But, hey, wait just a minute. Show me your tits. Oh, my. Seriously. I thought he was going to say, show me your tits. Delegate these things to your staff. Anyways. I want you to take care of them personally. Don't mind me, ma'am. And Spencer's going up. With you. <laughs> Five hours from now, I'll be a military <laughs> rescue transport at the airport. I'm throbbing with suspense. Can you hear me? My suspense boner is peaked. I'm so hard with suspense. Oh god damn, Bernie Sanders is a general in this no. universe? What the fuck? I hope you're beginning to understand. What? Oh, uh, she said she organized it with General Sanders. So there's two options. It's Bernie Sanders or Colonel well, Sanders, and I'd like to prefer great. that it would be Bernie. I guess somebody is Buttons, come on. You, you can do better than that. <laughs> <laughs> Briscoe, would you like to be on that? You like that, Marco? You like that PS2 buoy? Marco's gay. That... He gets no say in tits. You want to get out of here? No one does. I'm getting suspense points for this. Uh, I'll do anything. <laughs> oh, he'll do anything. Well, then I have a little favor to ask. A favor, ma'am? Please let it be. I need you to die. You're not getting laid, buddy. So. One of our men is being held in detention. Damn it! In a certain place. I have not been paying attention at all. <laughs> I Please, don't know if this is a news ask. company or like a biotech company because it goes back and Glenn forth. Buckland, yeah, this. I oh, know. Marcos Pan. Never mind. I've been corrected advisor. on my own ass self. I'm afraid he was left behind. Still locked up. I dare say the plot of this is less or more confusing than House of the Dead. I'd like you to go rescue him. I think the, the main confusion okay. from this plot is you it feels like it's trying to do too many things at once. Is all right. Isn't that what you said? What was well, that? Yes. What, is it Alone yes, in the course. Dark? So where is what about that it? That has like the weird ancient Egyptian shit going on. Research room. I don't know. The original Alone in the Darks, like the like the original ones, are like very different from the later ones. Got it. Well, I don't know. I kind of want to play the OG yeah, ones to be honest. Sure. Oh, like, nice. Clock Tower one and two. I would love to play Clock Tower one and two. I mean, the the original one was like Sega Saturn PS one three D O. I know. <laughs> There's like no hope of me being able to play it, but I would love to. Is what I'm saying. If you want, if you want to. Yes, ma'am. Maybe. It, Maybe I could like, give you permission over, um, what's it called? Parsec and accurate at all times, you know. Oh, maybe. On my... Yes, of course. Or I could just give you the the the, the way to play it. Yeah. For herself. 
Take the That's not true at all. Get it right. If nothing else, we've learned that pros make this all of the excuses. Will be your moment of truth. I got yeah. pros. I got pros in different, in different area, area code. Very well. Oh, I can skip this. Can I skip this? Oh, never mind. She's already done. Shit. We just talked over the whole Excuse thing. It's us. fine. I didn't know I could. Professional LPers. Well, that was pretty disappointing, Briscoe. I yeah, I feel professional. I haven't paid attention at all to the plot, so I must be getting good at LPing. It was like I couldn't go against her, you know? Didn't you feel the same way? No, I, was, Not especially. I looked at her boobies. Wait, though. does she have, like, fucking time, telekinetic powers now? My boss. So what? Who knows? In five years, our positions could be reversed. Yeah, right. Guns, you can't argue with that lady. You're really something. But never mind that. Let's get to that library. Oh, can I can I kvetch about a real first world kind of problem right now? Like sure. the sure. ultimate first world white girl problem. Yeah. Every time yeah. it feels like every time. Right. That I finally work up the courage to go to like a Sephora or an Ulta or something to like get good makeup to actually get color matched and like start legitimately doing makeup. We go into another fucking shutdown. <laughs> like, oh, okay. Guess this is where we're going to be. Wonderful. Oh, there's music. There's foreboding music. So I just want the poor guy up. color match, cruelty free, preferably vegan makeup. This is too much to fired. ask. What are you talking about? That's right. I bet they were going to fire him or transfer and they do make something. makeup from. Animals, don't they? The yup. A lot of the cheap ones still are. Disturbed. Jesus. They shut him up in the library research like, I think Nyx has things that are... Nyx has a brand that is vegan, but not all of their stuff. What the hell is Britney's cat but doing? They're all... <laughs> but they're all gluten. They're all cruelty-free. Right. So... It can't be helped. Different people I feel, have different levels of ability, I would prefer right? for them to be vegan, but I also but can't afford to like break a budget right now with it. The same thing Especially because I'm ask. just starting with it. So I'm like, happen. I got some like lines. Like it needs to be cruelty free. Would prefer for it to be vegan. Or at least a brand that has vegan options, so I'm supporting it still, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh if it's Leaping Bunny certified, that's like even better. Oh, oh man, those tacos I had. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Three, two, one. Now on, Good evening, everyone. we'll have to do our own research. I'm reporting to you now from in front of the Von Erich Library. Our news team has remained behind here in the city, still covered in a mysterious fog. I'm bald, so... <laughs> Apparently, according to information... I'm working out for you, huh? Recently, yeah. There's a man still here at this library who's been... I don't give a fuck about shit. I'm so tempted to shave my hair off. Like, it's been... Since February, I've been like, what if I just buzz all my hair off? Just... Gone. So you'll be bald? I'm now so afraid, like, I've always wanted one of those cute shaved undercut haircuts, but I am so afraid that I have, like, a misshapen head. <laughs> We're now going to try and find the research room where the man is reportedly- Shut the fuck up, dog! I just got real aggressive at my dog. This is a checkout desk. This is where books would order- Oh, we're actually on air. ...in the library. As you can see, That's cool. there's no one here now. So well, she's gonna be my descriptor. Let's see what we got As around you here. Can see, the library's interior is dim. The this shelves is. are filled with row upon row of neat, orderly books. We're just gonna get the fuck out of the way. There were so many prompts there and they're just not there now. I'm so sad. I've never regrown the hair I lost from that real bad stress when I lost my job and the whole breakup thing. Yeah. That's like still super thin. I lost my. I was gonna lose my hair no matter what because of my genetics. Um, I did lose my hair probably quicker than I would have because of stress that happened in high. So it's a killer, man. The hair killer.
It really is. I used to have really thick hair, and now it's just, like, thin and... Ugh. I still get good curls out of it sometimes, but I just miss having that really thick hair that I used to have in, like, high school. I'm trying to figure out how I lost hair from stress this after way. high school- after college, when college was literally just stress and drugs. Like, <laughs> my hair was fine then! Are we locked? There's a keypad? It won't open. It's oh, an electronic thought. lock. Damn, Aisha. Burns today. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Put some fucking respect on that name. God damn. The lock is broken. You can't get in. Alright, so we gotta find a code. Oh, is that a door I missed? Oh, God, well, two broken locks. Alright. Go upstairs. Rolling around. It's called getting older? No. <laughs> Refuse. Also, I'm like getting real bummed There's a no out. sandwich. I'm starting to get her gray hair, but it's like silver. I'm really sad. I really wanted white hair, and I don't think it's gonna happen. You can just dye it. But I wanted white hair so it would be easier to do the funky colors when I'm, like, retired. Because, mm. like, I bleached my hair once. It was terrible, and I will never do it again. Um, but I was, just hope I was just hoping genetics would, like, give me a W for once in my life and let me have white hair. But it doesn't look like it's gonna happen, folks. Next for a bitch, man. Whoa, what? I don't know. I got that gave me big, big suspense. Saka boy holds the camera, but apparently, okay. Oh, is there? No, oh, there's a step stool again. All right. Ladder? No, it's a step ladder. All right, there's gonna be some books way on high. Or not. That's okay. I don't think any of these fucking things are helping me here, so we're gonna go. Hoof it. Big ass. Fucking ass. Briscoe, I swear to Christ. <laughs> Useless. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Books are very old. They're old books. Books are old now. I'm gonna go, oh. Huh? The book. Oh! It's floating? They're, they're fucking. Those books are Those fucking. Those books are definitely fucking. This book fucking. Oh. My, my E points aren't going up though. Oh my god, there's. The content. Be nice to relax and read some books, but there's no time for that now. Okay. What the fuck? Fuck why? Why? Why though? Labor, I have no fucking idea what's going on anymore. To be honest with you. Uh, key code it needs to get begotten, but I don't. Where is she? Probably still on here. 
Yeah, bitch, I ain't find nothing. Oh, here's a computer, though, that I never looked at. <laughs> M librarian. Do not fuck book, even if M books. But is it working? Oh, yes, it's working. Guys, do you remember when I worked in the library for four years? What could it be? I remember. I also remember... That's not a book research terminal. It's a security camera monitor. You also remember... Well, it's alright. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna make sure I don't miss anything that might be puzzle important. What oh, okay. What appeared glance to be a research terminal was actually a surveillance system. It seems every room in the library can be observed right here on this monitor. Went down. Camera view. Zoom in and zoom out. That's what we like. Control camera. Um, so, what? That's a strange way to arrange the shelves. Are you just supposed to find that there's a fucking hidden room? Look, there's somebody there. There's a man in the small room at the back. Could this be the man that was locked in? He appears to be afraid of something. Oh, I'm a I'm a dummy. That's right. Up and down is like I've I've been doing that on accident. Oh, the key. Oh, hey, there we go. There's something there. It's really small. I can't see it very well. Okay, there's a movie. What I was gonna say. I remember this movie called UHF with, with Weird Al Yankovic, and uh. Where they just create their own, um, they or not create, but they take over like a local station. They make their own television programming, and there's, oh boy. and there's one called Conan the Librarian. Look, that's fucking amazing. And he's like, someone comes up to him and he's like, and he's like, do you know where this book is? And he's like, don't you know the Dewey Decimal System? And just cleaves the guy in half with a great sword. It's fucking like... Wait, go back to that puzzle. Uh, Michigan. It's five. The answer is five. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh, it, it's really easy because we're, we're English speakers. Like, if you go to the puzzle again, if you want the explanation. Nah, I'm good. Okay. I mean, you can explain it, but I'm not going back. So it had, like, 19, or 13 call? plus whatever plus whatever plus whatever, and Here underneath was Michigan. 13 yeah. is the, like, that's the 13th, M is the 13th letter in the alphabet, I is whatever, like, right. it's super easy because we're English speakers, like, we know that association. Can you hear me? This is Justine Rhodes from Zaka TV. Can you hear me? Don't worry. You want to build a snowman? What is with all of these dumbasses no screaming when there is a spooky me. monster thing? Oh no. It looks like it's electronically locked. Yeah. yeah we got we got that. We're we're Gucci with that. So fucking good at getting suspense. <laughs> I'll never get TNA. All right. Press five. Well, we gotta get the, get the key. Oh, a step ladder. Get the key that we found. We're getting down books from up top. Yeah, but you can get the key up here. If I climb the step ladder, I'll see what's on top of the shelves. So she's not gonna mention the key, which means technically, when I looked at this before, she could have just did it. You just got a spooky screen buttons. If it wasn't 9.30 at night, I, I super would. My housemates would probably be very concerned. I think, um, if it's okay with y'all, the next save point, I'm gonna call it, just because I don't know... How much I mean, longer the next session will be? Yeah. Like, the next chapter? Yeah. 
Because we got to take into account a variance of, like, me figuring the fucking shit out, too, you know? Yeah. Which, man, it is becoming more and more obtuse, so... The old books on the shelves give off a faintly musty odor. It's a typical smell of libraries. I don't know how to explain this. Like, it's both easy, but also difficult. Probably makes no sense, but... I wonder what the second floor looks like. Let's go and see, shall we? Yeah, let's go. Holy shit, Briscoe. Hey, we're here. You gonna report? You gonna report on something? Do some reporting. Oh, fuck. Oh, 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 oh. It opened. Just pushed me to the side. <laughs> I wonder what this room is for. It seems to be a perfectly ordinary room. Or... There's a desk and a few other things here and there. Bacon. There seems to be some kind of note. This says... The answer to the equation. The date on the calendar. The arrangement of the bookshelves. Broken clock. Okay. Nope, nope. Not the computer. The... There we go. Dear D. Can't believe what happened. I think I've been taking the whole thing a little too lightly. It's, yeah, but your words of courage have helped me hang in there somehow. Thank you, from M. And Death Note should Yeah, the been. bookshelves were definitely a three. The puzzle is a five. Oh, yeah, I gotta press X. Oh! Shoot up! Shoot up! Well, we, the, the prompt. Thank you. Alright. Come on. Come on, Briscoe. Yeah, Briscoe, get the fuck out of the way. Yo. Wait for me! Just the worst. Those enemies are the worst monsters. With the exception of like that cheap death, like they are not threatening. All right. Oh, it's a list of people. You don't. Okay, I don't need it. Eat shit and die, Prisco, yep. Five, right? Or is it three? There's a three and a five. We don't have enough numbers. We gotta go back oh. to the security camera. Uh-oh. We don't know the code. What? Because they're all you in the they're all in the security the camera. Okay. You should try paying attention. When they, when they let me do it, I'll Haven't just ram them. Notes or anything? Let's see. I think it was one, two, three, six, or something like that. I'm gonna scream. I'm gonna fucking pre. I'm gonna pre, dude. Go fucking pre. <laughs> I know. I know how to do it. I know how to do it. So that was for the key. Key. What kind of key have I been doing here? So that's for three. Take a look at that. The way those bookshelves are set up. 
Doesn't it look like a number? Oh. Uh, number three. Doesn't it look like a three? Yeah, yeah, I got you, bud. And what? Lavery said broken clock number. I don't remember which room has the clock, but that is a good thing to look at. Oh, his face is all fucked up. I mean, wouldn't yours be? Makes me want to pre. Can you zoom in on the the le the book that's on the floor? Mm, I could. Is that a thing? I cannot go down. Okay. That's, that's five. The five. The clock. Nine. Nine. Ooh, glad it fucking glitched. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, so three, five, nine. Oh, fucking pre. I feel like there has to be one more. Unless it's... Are you swapping the rooms or is it automatically? It's me. That? Where do you want me to go? Um, go back to the room with the dude in it. Wait, where's the calendar? Calendar? I should say there's a calendar somewhere. Stop zooming in on his face. I'm going pre, dude. No, it's driving me nuts. I'm fucking pre. That's not a calendar. That's, That's a clock. The clock. There's been one for every room. All right. I'm so, calendar. the note before mentioned the date on the calendar. Uh, what that? What is, I think. Hmm. This was the key, right? That's three. Right. This is five. Oh no! Yeah. This is the dude. So here, here's my here's my problem is that I cannot make this go down. So if that's the calendar right there, I don't no, know. No, 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 no. What note are you talking about, Aisha? There's that note we found in the room that's like the, the broken clock, the this and that, and it's... it's maybe it's the calendar's you... just... Maybe the calendar's just in the room and we don't need the camera for it. It is some hella good CCTV. You are absolutely right. I'm free. Oh, can access these fucking. Woo! What was that on the floor? What? What? The lamp. Oh, okay. Fucking lamp. The calendar was in front of the place, if I remember right, like the place where you came in from. Note in the room said, answer the equation. The on the calendar, the arrangement of the bookshelves, broken clock. Okay, you mean let me in the fucking. Yo, nope, it will not let me back. It will not oh, let me in. Oh, wait a minute. I think the note on the calendar means the thing above the desk, so it should be 539. Oh, we got four. Oh! Hey, there's something on the floor. On the vid tape. It's a videotape. Let's pick it up. You said I'll pick it up? Wait, okay. Yeah. Got a videotape. Cool beans. Glad we came up here again, I guess. 539, you said? Uh, it should be 539. Alright. Everybody is like that better be born. <laughs> Three, nine. Ooh, agree. Wait, wasn't the calendar number second? I thought it was. The note on the calendar, the the configuration of the bookshelves, and the broken clock, right? That was the order? Uh, 
Uh-oh, you don't know the code. What? There's four numbers, four numbers. Can't figure out the code? All right, see, so let's follow Moon's thing. The calendar was in front of the place, if I remember right, like the place where you came in from. Where do you, okay, the place I came in from, you're gonna be a little more specific. Like where I began? Where I began this area? Your stream is significantly behind the chat, so you're gonna have to wait a second. Oh, okay. Oh, there it is. Eight. Okay, so eight, three, nine, five? What fucking pre, dude? <laughs> uh oh, you don't know the code. All right, so. You can't figure out the code? You should try paying eight, attention. Eight, three... Haven't you been we did A395, right? No. No idea. Hold on. Eight, three, five, nine. Eight, three, nine, five. Yeah. Uh-oh, you don't know the code. Mm -hmm. All right. Aisha says you eight five three nine, so I might I might be remembering the you riddle wrong. Try paying attention. Oh, I have one request, Judd. Yeah. When we play Silent Hill three, yeah, we play it on hard riddle difficulty. I heard that fucking sucks. The truth. There's, there's one. No, most of them are good. There's one in particular that I absolutely love. That's just bad shit insane. And I'm sure Lavery knows exactly which one I'm talking about. Code. You can't figure out the code? You should try. Alright, we're gonna listen to fucking Brisco. Have you been taking notes or anything? Now, let's see. I think it was five, eight, three, nine, or something like that. Five eight three nine. Yeah. It opened. Damn it, Briscoe! I hate that you were useful. Are you all right? I'm Justine Rhodes from Zaka TV. He's dead. We came He's to dead AF. Ah! Fucking dead. Oh, I can move. He's been killed. Another monster, maybe? Look! Over there! It's an air vent. Oh. Oh, yeah! Attack this guy. <laughs> the worst has happened. A monster. It seems a monster found its way inside here. Oh, there you go. It's we finally happening. We at Saka happening. TV tried to get the door open as quickly as possible to rescue him. But, unfortunately, when we arrived... He had already been killed in the horrible way you see here. The monster probably came in through the air vent, killed the man, and then vanished. This is how you do Our TV. Now in danger too. I think we'd better leave this place. This is how you do professional news. Justin Rhodes reporting to you from the Von Eric Library. Okay, that was good. Of course. Even the chief can possibly find anything to complain about with that. She'll oh, I'm it. sure she could. A uh, man has died. I bet she will. What with the gross footage and all. Hey, wait a minute. Is that this guy's notebook? We might as well film this while we're at it. August 23rd. Been locked up here for three days now. Around 24th this day, I'm supposed to go to the club. Gotcha. Gotta get out of here. I gotta meet with Dr. O'Connor, or my whole plan will be ruined. Hmm. I bet he was fired. There's something written under today's date. He was supposed to meet a Dr. O'Connor at Club Gucci today. Gucci! <laughs> I wonder who this Dr. O'Connor is. Club well, Gucci. I but I bet he knows the truth behind this mysterious fog and the monsters. So you want to go there? Of course! It's a big scoop! All right, I am going to 
It'll be a little earlier than we planned, but we're gonna call it there. Uh, save. Okay. Okay. So here's the steez. Um, tomorrow, same bad time, same bad channel, seven o'clock. I guess we'll finish Michigan. Report from I hell. Yes. I guess if might it's, as well. Because if, if if it takes as long as they say, um, and then I guess I'll, to my surprise, I'll start on, Silent Hill. Hell yeah! So, is it is it obvious that I'm excited? Damn. All right. Well, I guess. Uh, so next week, just real quick before I forget to, uh, Monday will be. I'll probably start at seven again, but Monday will be the usual Shovel Knight stream. In fact, I think it's the finale and like the last of the DLC. So I'm done with Shovel Knight after that. Um, I am going to be out of town visiting friends, so. There'll be no Thursday, Friday. So we're going to start Silent Hill tomorrow and then, like, not fucking play it for, like, a week. So, <laughs> enjoy that. Um, But, yeah. Uh, otherwise, I guess we'll see y'all tomorrow for more... Uh, for more news hijinks and then horrible uh, inner demon torment later after that. <laughs> And who boy, it's horrible. <laughs> who boy. All right. Good night, all. Thanks for coming. Say bye, Buns. Good night.